well, 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 what do we have here today? Hello, Chad. How are you doing, you amazingly beautiful beings? Welcome to the stream. I do hope you enjoy your stay. I promise you, this was not a mistake. Or was it? Dun, dun, dun. Oh, my lights are off. Well, look at that. We're going to have a spooky stream today. I'm just going to sit like this and be all like really creepy and moody. I thought like it was a bit too comfortable for my eyes. That explains why. Hello, blinding light. I mean, we are God after all, so blinding light makes sense. Hello, Chad. How are you doing? Welcome in. I do hope you enjoy your stay here today. I recognize so many beautiful names in the chat. Oh my god, I'm so glad to see you all again. Last time I'm currently breaking my little mic arm. Last time we were on here together was the release party for the emotional support demon. And it has not slowed down. It is absolutely nuts. Okay. Okay, so as of this moment, link in the top of the description, by the way, if you missed it, because this will be gone forever once the campaign ends, okay? Okay? I'm just like marketing, creating a bit of a rush and a bit of desperation. I am desperate indeed. We have... Oh my, it's a 10,935. I think that we are just about to reach number two best selling of all time on Makeship. And they told me that it was the number one fastest funded campaign in the company's history. That is kind of nuts. Uh, thank you all so much. I never expected anything close to this. Um, I expected it to do like, you know, maybe half of Mango, which was already insane. But no, apparently not. You guys decided just like, hippity hoppity, I'm gonna blow up this poor plushy website. So uh, there you go. We're reaching for the stars. Indeed we are. Today, chat. we're gonna play something beautiful. Have you heard of World Box? World Box is like the ultimate relatively simple but very fun god simulator so you have a world you place down humans or orcs or elves or dwarves whatever you want the civilizations to be and you just let them build and you can blow it up if you want to you can help them if you want to you can just leave them to it and see what happens if you want to and they will slowly advance through the ages so imagine like a sieve but you don't actually play it yourself. You're an observer and you can choose to like help people or blow it up or whatever you want to do. And I figured what better way to be like absolutely insane and mad with power than to just do this. I still love you and still my comfort YouTuber Axel Pit. Welcome in your beautiful bean. I do open your nose. Got a f the bahabagabala. You're so handsome today, Click. Thank you so much, Ali. You are very handsome today. I put on the vest, actually not to dress up, just because it's winter and it's really cold. So, <laughs> you know, you know that time of the year in, in like northern parts of the world when the cold just hit and the heating systems haven't really caught up yet. So you have like a, a couple of days of awkward coldness. That's where we're at right now, baby. Of course, it's the best. The cutest demon. Thank you so much, Temple of the Gods. Uh, thank you very much. Look at this. I should add a squeaker into this. Imagine if we could like... That would be so good. I mean, if you're really crafty, you can do it yourself. But, like, uh, that would be amazing. My God. Uh, emotional support team version 2, anyone? Yes, indeed. Dad, thank you so much for the one. Marvel, thank you so much for the... That disappeared really quickly. Okay, let's see. Royal Lasso. I hope everyone is well. Thank you so much. Why are you gifting membership? Stop! Duh! Lomo, thank you so much for the five of the members. By the way, Chad, if you didn't know this... Um, I am currently trying to rework some of the VIP stuff on the Discord server because we realized that not everything is being utilized because it was utilized more like a year ago, but now it's a bit eh. But we're reworking some stuff and you get access to all that stuff with a membership. That's a weird way of selling it, isn't it? Like, hey, I am figuring shit out. If you want to see what I figured out, <laughs> join the memberships. <laughs> Amazing. Raphael, thank you so much for joining the Noble Lasso Squad. You amazing being this one is all for you. Mm. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Dr. Catspaw, I order my emotional support demon, and I hear it comes with a hot maid. Scor vet? Vet false marketing. I need to sew some. Va anyway, thank you so very much, you amazing. Let's see now. Let's see now. Okay, last time I refreshed this page, it was 10,935. And it's already up to 39. It's like every time I repress the pay, re repress, refresh the page. We're gonna do some repression later in this stream. Um, it, it just it just keeps going up. It's insane. I don't know why. The squeakers should be more demonic. Oh, like. <laughs> I think that's pretty good. Uh, maybe a little bit horrifying. At least your dog will not chew it up because they will like recoil as soon as they chew it. Lomos, why do you? 
Oh, upgrade your membership to Royal Lost. You can't do this. Uh, cheers. Mm. Oh, that's so good. You must. Mm. Savior. Hey, how is it going? Can I get a quick shout out for my small mecky? They are adorable and need to be told so. Small mecky, you are adorable and you need to be told so. That's why I told you so. Well, yes, indeed. <laughs> Whenever you tell someone something, it's important to have like uncomfortably intense eye contact. Otherwise, they don't believe it. Good morning. I hope you're having a good morning. You see? It's just so much more believable. Trust me, I'm a very sociable person. Are you still selling the VIP ticket to Hell and Horny Jail? Yes! I think the Horny Jail is out of stock with the pins. But everything else is uh, is there. So it should be good. It's on the Teespring store. I think I have the link to that in the description as well. Heck, yes indeed. What did I walk into? Just the warm up before we go all god. It's gonna be so much fun. I have been looking forward to streaming this game for quite some while. I just need, I just need to unlock a few things because in the game, achievements are locked to like... Uh, units and what things you can give to them, basically. So I really wanted to unlock a few things so I can I can be the god <laughs> that I want to be. It is the season of giving. So here, Lommels, you're way too sweet. Thank you so much. All right, everyone. All right, hello from Sweden. Hello there. Click, I know this is random, but I just want to say thank you. You make me smile whether you simply hit the upload button. It's affected my life so happily. That is so sweet. I mean, thank you for watching, Jesus. Thank you, all of you that I have this, well, job. But <laughs> it's amazing. It's amazing. Oh, my God. I can't believe, you know, back when I first did the jump to YouTube, I, I, was, I wasn't really considering trying it full-time to begin with, you know? When the channel first started doing well, and I mean well to the point where it could actually realistically pay the bills... I distinctly remember talking to a couple of friends because I was having a middle middle crisis at the time. I was like, damn, this seems like an opportunity, but I don't know if I want to make the leap. Like, this is a weird thing. And I explicitly told them that, you know, ah, I'm not sure if I want to go for this, you know, it's a bit silly and maybe I'll, you know, be, a, it won't mature and stuff like that, which, you know, the world's lost, I guess. Um, and like a month after that, I made the leap. And even at that time, even when I had gotten to the point where I made the leap to YouTube, I still didn't fully believe it was going to be some long-term thing, you know? It was like, you know what, I'm not super satisfied at work anyway, might as well quit and try this thing, because I'm probably going to quit in a couple of months anyway, because uh, it's not really my vibe anymore. And then it just worked. And I realized a while ago that I have been working with YouTube much longer than I've been working with any other job. It's kind of wild. I've been full-time with YouTube now for about three years. The job I had before that, about a year and a half. And I've had other jobs, like, part-time before that, that I had technically for longer spans of time, but not anything full-time. It's absolutely bonkers. This is, like, the longest career, not counting the academy, that I've had. It's insane. It's insane. Let's see how long it lasts. Baby, until I have, like, a crisis, or I'm too wrinkly to appear on camera. Hello, Click! Hope you're having a beautiful day. It's tea time. There's, it's always a beautiful day when I see you pop up. Kim! Half friend related, but one of my friends from college recognized Otis Keychains! I believe my college is full with lassos and beardos. Yes! That is beautiful! <gasps> that This just seems to be so highly condensed. Which surprises me, because I have been recognized a couple of times when I'm outside, you know? I got recognized when I went to a con, I got recognized on the train a couple of times, I got recognized uh, when I was traveling once. So that it happens, but not like every day, right? It's not that common, so that you have had such a high density in your college is absolutely nuts. Anyway, shall we get started with God- Oh my god, I'm looking forward to this. Oh my god, I'm gonna blow things up. No wait, I'm gonna be a good- man Manevolent benevolent, or something like that. Is it a little bit- a little bit of both? A little bit of a woo. All right, baby. We, I'm so. I recognize you on YouTube every day, Mimi. That is very true. Yes, indeed, that is very true. By the way, get your emotional support, demon, today before it's gone forever. <clears throat> Absolutely beautiful. Thank you. Thank you for. It's so cute. I love the horns. It's so. I'm so happy with how it turned out. I did not expect it to be that good. Honestly, I was like, you know, eh, the design is okay, I suppose. And now, once it's once it's landed. And I'm no longer looking at it with, like, design eyes and trying to pick apart everything that I think is a slight flaw. I'm like, damn, it's good. <laughs> so, yes, indeed. Okay. All right. All right, here we go. Let me let me prepare this. Check this out, Chan. Check the filter. Chroma key. Wait. 
<gasps> mango! No oh, there are like three twerking mangoes on the screen. Great. Uh, B, thank you so much for becoming a last one. Mango. Aw. Aw, we have been through. Aw. 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 Quickly, emotional sport demon. Aw. I mean, no, you're you're a demon. You're used to this kind of stuff. But aw. 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 Wait, Ohio still exists? Horrible news, chat. I'm so sorry you have to deal with that when you're dropping him in my stream. I usually try to make it a deal to keep it positive here, you know. Oh, Ohio. Anyway, Kim, it makes me wilder than it's a tiny college with a 300 student max. It's an absolute experience. Little do I know about me being the rascal. The secret idea is like Batman, but... Weird. Uh, well, <laughs> but in a good way. <laughs> Odin, thank you so much for becoming a royal lasso. That is way too generous. Thank you so much. Christmas is coming early this year. Boom! Oh! Look at how beautiful this is. Damn. Just joining right into the game. But let's see. Where's the best place to have my camera? Where's the best place? Because because here there's a bunch... Is this actually properly cropped? I don't think it is. Hold on. Zip! And zip! Oh my god, I'm so professional. How good I prepared this. All right. All right, let's see now. So, I'm not sure where where the best thing to have my camera is, because here are like a bunch of stuff. Hmm. Okay, wait, I, maybe if I put it upside down. Maybe if I put it upside down. Bottom right. That could work, but it's like a little bit awkward, because I would want to look, you know, this way. So it's like I'm watching the screen, but here's just a wall. So like... <laughs> That's why I would have it on this side, because it feels natural, you know? The camera looks at me from this angle. All right, all right, let's see. Uh, I'll try it in a regular place, for now. I can I can cut it a bit, though. I can cut it a bit. Emotional support demon, I still want you to be there. Oh, yes, indeed. I'll make it a bit smaller. There we go, that is gorgeous. Emotional support, hupti gupti. Very nice, very nice indeed. I guess I can do it like this, and just bloop. <gasps> There's more support demon to, to ever, oh, it's just looking up there, so adorable. I think this is good. This looks good, right? This looks good. It's covering some of the options, but the menu in general is like pretty wide, so I'm gonna cover something no matter where I am, I think. Or maybe, actually maybe I can like put it here and just shrink it a bit. So it's like I'm on top of the toolbar. That's actually not a bad idea. That's actually a pretty good idea, because now I'm not covering anything important, and I just have to make sure that I don't highlight any key battles and events right where my face is. Uh, we can extend that a little bit so it don't look so weird. There we go. Absolutely gorgeous. Uh, I think this looks pretty good. What do you think, Chad? Does it look beautiful? Let me just move around some screens first. There we go. Excellent. Excellent. Use the nukes. Relax. Relax. Perfect. 666 out of 10. Hell, you love to see it. Make some zombie frogs. Oh, I intend to make some zombie frogs before... We get ahead of ourselves. Let me just turn up the audio a bit so so the, the game is, like, hearable. That looks pretty good. Maybe turn it down a bit, actually. We don't need the click sounds to be that loud. That looks pretty good. Okay, so, ladies, gents, and non-binary frogs, welcome to World Box. This is the ultimate god experience, and we're totally not going to go mad with power. So in this game, I have just created... A little cute world with, you know, some different biomes, some islands, you know, a bit of water, a cloud. Here are some islands I was experimenting with with a thumbnail, but I kind of blew it up instead. Um, so anyway, in this world, we have two fine people. Lomas, thank you so much. We have two fine individuals. We have uh, Adam and we have Steve. Because they usually say, oh my god, it's, not Ad it's Adam and Eve, not Adam and Steve. I beg to differ. I am literally God, so shut up. Anyway, so so Adam is slow, and Steve is ambitious but weak. So I think we need to give them a little bit of a bump. And because I am God, <laughs> uh, I'm, I'm going to give them a, a good bump. Okay, so you're no longer slow. Boop. Okay, look at that. So now he's been poked. Scar of Divinity. Someone changed him forever. That's great. But I don't care so much. We're also going to favorite both of them before I forget, so we can keep tabs on these boys. So in this game, things tend to die, right? Just like in real life. But I want Adam and Steve to have a shot at eternal happiness. So I'm going to start off by making both of them immortal. So they do not die of old age. They're going to be, at least, so far in this world, they're literally on the humans. They're just going to never die of old age. 169 HP? Nice. One thing I also want to do is create a couple of different factions 
you know, go a little bit of Middle Earth on this, on this bish. So here's like a crystal biome, it looks like, or maybe it's ice cream. It's hard to tell. But I want dwarves. Sword, 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 my diamond, dwarf. And then over, no, not the same island. I want them to be separated. Here is like, this is a good orc place. Orcs love lemon trees. Excellent. And then we want some elves. The elves can be... They also can have a small island. They wanna they wanna live by themselves in this <laughs> shitty place. Perfect. Excellent. So now we have <laughs> God's favorite, Adam and Steve, obviously. If you're God, can you give Transformers a a animated a fourth season? Let's not get ahead of ourselves here. Civilization has to start before we can produce Transformers, okay? Chill chat. Jesus. Jamie, thank you so much for joining the Lasso Squad. I do wanna give Adam and Steve some more personality though. Adam feels like he, he's like a very huggable fellow. So he's a bit of a chonker. He's also very strong. Think like he's the bear of the couple, right? He's the couple bear. And he is also, he also regenerates. And I do want to do like this. They, they just have a bit of blessing, you know? They're, they're proof to like fire and all that kind of stuff. You know, they don't burn easy. They're be beautiful beings. And he's also shiny. He goes a bit like twilight, that kind of thing. I think that's a pretty good... Oh, he's also handsome. Yeah, he's attractive as shit. So this is Adam. He is strong, a chonker. He's very attractive. And I think that's pretty good. Um, nice. So this is Adam. What about Steve? Steve seems to be... He, he's kind of like the, the, small, the small love boy of the relationship, right? I'm going to give him some regeneration and this kind of stuff as well. He's, he's a smart boy, right? He's a genius. He also lost an eye when they were wrestling. <clears throat> without clothes. He's weak. He's not a good fighter, but he's strong-minded. He's also very attractive, and he's agile. He runs very fast, right? He's not chunky. And what else do we want him to have as part of his personality? Hmm. Very intriguing. What, el what else could be interesting? He's also small. He's tiny. Perfect. So this is, this is <laughs> Adam and Steve. You see? Perfect, perfect platonic, totally platonic relationship. Excellent. I love what I see here. I love what I see. Uh, I think Adam should also be a bit stupid. Like, that's very cute. Like, he, he's the big, huggable teddy bear. He's basically a Hodor, but but as a couple. And 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 Steve is the smart little shit, right? This is per- <laughs> He's so small! I think I can even make it worse. Look at this. Poink! Oh wait, they both became big, but that's a, that's a temporary effect, I think, so it doesn't really matter. I'm also, before I keep going, I'm also gonna make them both blessed. You're both blessed, whatever the hell that means. You have my blessing. Go forth, chunk, s stupid, and small smart. <laughs> this is amazing. All right, so this is Adam and Steve. They have this big, scary world to conquer. I'm also gonna scatter a little bit of valuable resources, a little bit all over the world. So I'm going to give them a few patches of stone here around the area they're starting, just so they can build some houses and shit. Some silver hiding over here. We're going to have an island of gold right out here. So the civilizations that get to do some boat-faring stuff, they might be able to reach this gold eventually. Look at this. Riches await on the other side of the ocean. Hell yeah. That's very cool. This is the Orc Island. Uh, I'm just going to give them a bit of stone and a little bit of ore. Same thing here, I'm just going to scatter some random ore, so they, they have some stuff to get started. And down on this piece of the land, that basically, I don't know, is like a cool savanna, it has a little bit of ore scattered. And then adamantite, which is going to take a while until they can use, because it's a very complex resource. And then maybe some mithril for the dwarves. Where did I put the dwarves? They were in the crystal thing, right? They can have some mithril down here. Excellent. Isn't that perfect? And here is a little bit of ore. Just scatter a few pieces so they can run around and try to pick it up. Splendid. I think I think we're good to go, chat. I think we're good to go. Isn't that beautiful? And there will appear other stuff, of course. Urks! Are you ready, chat? Are you ready? This world is going to be astounding. Look at them! I love Adam and Steve already. I hope they don't die. I might be a bit biased. Let's go. Is the game speed good? Yeah, yeah, it's good. So here is Adam and Steve. Are you gonna form your vill- Yay! It's Holy Ido! What a good name for a kingdom. Uh, hold on. <laughs> I'm not so sure about this, fam. Like, I don't wanna- I don't wanna step on your parade here or anything, but like... But like, damn. Okay, okay. Um, 
So this is these are all the kingdoms that we have formed. So this is the Holy Ido. Um, may, maybe maybe we can just give it a small adjustment. I'm gonna. This is the Holy Owo. Perfect. That's excellent. Uh, so these are the elves. I'm just gonna name these ones something like. What do you think I should name, <laughs> name the elves? Ohio? <laughs> this is a, <laughs> the kingdom of Ohio full of elves. <laughs> Maybe that's more fit. No, no, wait, wait, wait. Wait, wait, wait. No, 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 no. I'm gonna... Ohio should be the orcs. <laughs> Ohio is the orcs. <laughs> okay, that's Ohio. <laughs> the elves should be something like... Um, I don't know. I don't know. Maybe, maybe like New York. New York is perfect. And then like uh, the dwarves can be Sweden. That's amazing. There we go. There we go. Here are the legendary kingdoms of Holy Owo, New York, Sweden, and Ohio. Maybe, maybe, maybe. <laughs> should this just be Florida? <laughs> Florida. <laughs> okay. All right. So the kingdom of Florida is just filled with Florida elves. Perfect. I think this is amazing. We have Ohio, Sweden, Florida, and Holy Owo. <laughs> Calm down, chat. Calm down. Jesus. It's everything is just exploding, isn't it? Okay. We haven't even done anything yet. Boom. Holy Owo. We have Sweden over here, Ohio up here. Ohio already has... Oh, maybe I placed down four orcs. Or maybe they've been really good at making babies. This is Ezaz, who's very paranoid, apparently. Poor Ezaz. Okay, let's go. Boom. Look at him running around. Look at this boy. Oh my god, this is Onet, who's a pacifist. What a peaceful orc. Wow. What, what do you have? You're content. The orcs are so happy. I mean, apart from the paranoid one. How are Adam and Steve doing? Have we made any babies yet? Hello, Adam and Steve. God damn, you beautiful. Look at- He's shining! Look at those sparkles! He's actually shining! Oh, <gasps> He's a big, chunky, shiny teddy bear! I love Ad- Oh, that's E- that's, No, that's Adam. This is Steve. Yeah, th that's Steve. Do you like your shiny, big, chunk boyfriend, Steve? God, that's beautiful. Okay, okay, that's absolutely amazing. So they're just harvesting some stuff here, surviving the wild. They got a fireplace down. <gasps> There's a little monkey! Oh, look at that! They have a little monkey! Is it tame? It's called Heno. It's agile and it's a genius, like Curious George. Well, the Holy Owo is really just wow, amazing performance. Sweden is already a three population. Look at these dwarves. They're just going out. They're harvesting things. They're running around here. This is Gore, whatever his name is. We gotta check on Florida, man. Florida, we need to keep an eye on. Fucking Florida elves. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's tiny! Look at this tiny elf! <gasps> and here's a Bobby, two years old. Amazing. Peaceful and weightless. Just like a baby. Is th this dude is just naked. The hell is up with- You're just completely nude. Why aren't you wearing clothes? If you and OG were a bear couple, <laughs> I wish you would be with a bear which tied a cute one. Also, thank you for everything you give us. Well, OT is definitely, like, buffer than I am. But I am also significantly taller because OT is, like, 3'5". So, you know, it's difficult. <gasps> Adam and Steve made a man baby. Is that the baby right there? Oh my god, it's Busso. What a beautiful name. Attractive as well, you see? You see? And they say evolution isn't real. How do you prove that Adam and Steve, that were both attractive, had an attractive baby? How do you prove that? Checkmate, anti-evolution. I mean, I'm literally God sitting here, like, being a super creationist, aren't I? But like, but checkmate! Yeah! Take that. <laughs> okay. He's just chopping away at this house. Look at that. He's such a crafty boy. Steve is such a crafty boy. How's Adam doing? Adam is like... Oh, it's raining. Oh, it's over here. Oh my god, it's like a thunderstorm. Did someone die? I hope they didn't die. Damn, they're populating... Look, they're breeding like bunnies. Florida is already up to six people, which is incredibly concerning. What, what the hell is this? This is Lola. Attractive, paranoid... Poison immune. I don't even know. Is this a lump? This is just a lump. Did you make this? Hel naked man? Nake naked Florida elf? Did you make this one? <laughs> what? What are you? Okay. Okay. You, I, I feel like naked Florida elf. It has a bit of my love, right? We're gonna give naked Florida elf some love. You know? They just strike me as, you know... Lovable. Setter, thank you. West, thank you so much for the royal lasso. You're beautiful being this one. You're very lucky. And you're also attractive, obviously. And you're buff. Otherwise, you wouldn't walk around without clothes. You're also very agile. Because, yeah. 
You're also a genius because you just understand that being naked is an absolute power move. You're not tiny, you're a big boy. You're also wise because who would not walk around without pants while being wise? So he's just a buff genius, basically. He's also immune, regenerates health, and I'm just gonna do some of this stuff so he doesn't die. That's, that's amazing. He's also very honest. He's an honest buff man. He has a bit of bloodlust, though, because he's a Florida man. So bloodlust is like, obviously, yeah. Uh, gold tooth because swag. Okay, perfect. Look at that. This is naked Florida elf. I also have to favorite you. There you go. Did I make you immortal? I did. Perfect. You're not gonna die of old age. We have another main character. It's naked Florida elf. Wow, he just built a house with, with a stick. That is amazing. You're such a good boy. <laughs> Immortality! Immortality only means that they don't die from old age. So, you know, if they die, it's because someone stabs them in the face. Which makes for a more interesting story for the main characters, in my opinion. So, here's Ohio. How are, how are the orcs doing? This is... Uh, who has regeneration and savage. Loves burgers. Have you even invented burgers yet? Like, you're still running around eating sticks, basically. Do, do, you, do you have burgers? <laughs> Put that just texted me and said, please, animals. All right, fine. The orcs, they get along well with... I'm gonna give everyone a few puppies. Just puppies for everyone. Puppies. Adam and Steve? Puppies. Shit tones of puppies. Look how happy they are. Wow, everyone loves puppies. I feel like here is like a little bear area, because they, they like the mushrooms. All right? And we got- we need wolves, we need some uwu. They can be here in the savannah, together with some, uh, uh, hyenas. This seems like a very hyena-esque place. And we also need some animals to guard the gold, right? Let's just- there's a rat king guarding the gold, because rat kings are greedy. Excellent. And we're just gonna have some chicken up here, because yes. <gasps> Crocodile! Florida needs crocodiles! Or- or gators. Gators! Are they gonna kill the population now? I hope not. They seem kind of peaceful. The Florida- the naked Florida elf gets along well with the gators. Krika. Perfect. <gasps> Who's this? Oh, so not- wait, how many babies do you have? You already have 13 kid. You're 26 years old! Naked Florida elf is 26 years old and already has 13 kids. Holy freaking shit! <laughs> naked Florida elf, I swear to god- I'm also gonna give you this- You already have regeneration, okay, fine. Oh my god! Absolutely out of control! Good evening, Click. How are you doing? Thank you so much, Krakachan, for the noble lasso. You're beautiful, being this one is so... Mwah. Thank you so much. He knows how to do things. Indeed, he does. Oh my god, he's a crafty fella. Like, he has... He has literally bred every single person in Florida. Because they were like two people, two or three people when they started. And 13 of these... Yeah! Oh my fuck! Yeah, because it was only naked Florida elf and one more person that started in Florida. So, f the whole population is literally his kids, apart from one person who he, who he, he mated with. That's it. It, it. The entirety of Florida is naked Florida elf's offspring. Holy shit. He, he <laughs> okay, that's very ambitious. I'm proud of you. Sweden has already developed a boat. Dirtkin. Beautiful boat. How is Sweden doing? We don't have really have like a lord of Sweden yet. Who's our favorite here? Here's a random person chopping. Gore. You only have seven children. You're not very ambitious. You're not very exciting. Dig. Um, yeah, these are the dwarves, right? Yeah, these are the dwarves. What on earth is this? It's just a living sword. Well, that doesn't seem very friendly. Okay. Well, I don't th feel like a dwarf have really stood out yet. They haven't proven themselves to their god. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know, man. They don't really have us. Oh, here's someone. No. No, they don't really have the same jabang as like the the naked Florida elf, for example. He's a legend. Or or uh, Adam and Steve. How's Adam and Steve doing, by the way? Look at this. Adam has had 12 babies, and Steve has also had 12 babies. They have made 12 babies together. Wow. Buzo is also attractive. Look at that. They're just breeding beautiful babies. Look. <gasps> Agile genius. Oh, no, that was the monkey. Sorry, that was the monkey. That's not a baby. Um... Where are the rest of, <laughs> where are the rest of the babies at? They're just running around here. And these ones are what is this? Peaceful, never attacks first. Okay, so they're racing handsome babies and pacifists. <laughs> Great. Amazing. Oh how's Ohio doing? <laughs> oh my god, what a big boy! Holy shit! This is Uhe. Ohe is a buff boy. 
This is the super orc. Yeah, this is Uhe. No, champion of Ohio. This is champion of Ohio. Okay, we're gonna give you some love. You are the chosen. You're honest. No, you're not honest. You have bloodlust. You are blessed, though. Definitely attractive. Definitely strong and chonky. Okay, you can't be agile and chonky at the same time, but you can be fast. I'm gonna give you some immunity so you don't die from bullshit. Perfect. Regeneration you already have. Um, you're definitely lucky, right? Genius. No. Short-sighted for sure and shiny. Those seems like very champion of Ohio. And you're definitely ambitious. You want to rule stuff. And you're strong-minded. This is a beautiful person. And you're gluttonous. Of course it's gluttonous. This is a beautiful person. A beautiful person. Champion of Ohio. You are now God's favorite. Make me proud or I will be very sad. All right? Come on now, champion of Ohio. Go forth and breed a kingdom. <laughs> you have no idea how much happiness you bring me. Jay, that is so sweet. Welcome in. I do hope you enjoy your stay. Oh my god, what is going on here? Look, it's the monkey. It's throwing poo at the crystal sword and it killed... Wow, the monkey actually killed it. Holy shit. Here, here are all the Swedish dwarf babies running around. This is Gith Teal. Bam. I don't know, these, they don't really stand out yet. I need I need a character. I need a character. How, how is naked Florida elf doing? Oh, he's just cuddling with crocodiles now. And now he's hiding in the... I saw you. He's still not wearing pants, though. Still not wearing pants. I do love this character. Yeah, that's amazing. All right, cool. How is our beauty? <gasps> oh my god! That is so adorable! Look! Look! Adam and Steve are both like king and mayor. That is, they made political career. I mean, they're literally political careering over their own kids. So, I mean, it's, uh, maybe it's not that impressive, but like, damn. Damn, look at that. Kingdom lay. Okay, let's check out the kingdoms. So, Sweden. Sweden has a king. They have Gehevro. Only 12 children, amateur. Uh, the Holy Owo. Steve is the king. Yeah, he's the smart one. So, that makes sense. Steve is the smart king. And the mayor, who's like the leader of other more hands-on stuff, is, uh, is Adam. So that's perfect. Look at that. Oh, he's such a good leader. He's like smart and, and stuff. Amazing, Steve. Proud of you. Ohio doesn't have a king yet, and neither does Florida. All right, we'll see where that goes. You're going to make them Cain and Abel? No, 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 no. This this just... May, maybe. I mean, they could have kids. Weak and peaceful. Look at that. What a cute little boy. Eight years old. Wow. Mm. Elliot, thank you so much for joining the lasso. Zelda. Guarantee you saved lives with... With supportive content? That is way too sweet. I mean... Oh, what did I do? Some I clicked on something by mistake. Did I play something? I think it's fine. I probably plays like a butterfly or something. I think we're fine. Okay. <laughs> it scared me for a sec. I just heard something go buck. <laughs> How is Ohio doing? How is Ohio? How do you even fit inside that house, champion of Ohio? God. You're already... Okay, 30... You only have 10 kids. You need to work faster, champion of Ohio. Jeez. Okay, how's Sweden doing? I mean, at least Sweden has a king, right? So this is the king of Sweden. And this is the mayor of, well, basically Stockholm. Um, Gorak. Okay, well, that's not, it's not a very traditionally Swedish name, but I suppose it will suffice. <laughs> Who's, the, oh my god, wait. <gasps> no, it's not naked. Yeah, it is naked Florida man. Naked Florida man. Is the, oh my god, look, naked Florida man got swag. It looks like it's just a bathrobe, so like there's no pants or shirts in the middle. So at least it's still like semi-naked, right? But uh, naked Florida man is now the king of Florida. <laughs> or naked Florida elf, rather. Sorry, sorry. Don't want to misracify someone. Um, is this the, is this the, is this the, yeah, that's the mayor. Nishnierna. Well, great. Whatever. Um... Kingdom home, yeah, yeah. All right, how's the holy... Have anyone expanded? No, everyone is still on, like, their starting regions. But that usually takes a while until they develop a bit further. Look how cute they are. Oh, my God. Hello, King Steve. How are you doing? So they just have a ton of tons of kids running around. Here is someone that's actually grown up and chopping a tree. Who's this? So, 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 wow, wow. Great. They're actually breeding quite fast. They're already a 31 population. How's Sweden doing, though? How's Sweden doing? You have these, like, crystal monsters just running around killing cats. 
That's kind of interesting. Oh my god, the monkey really doesn't like Crystal Man. Look at that. They're just going at it. The cats and the monkeys are fighting the crystal people. Okay, well, they didn't do very well. Who is this? This is Brackbrock. Alright, well, seems kind of ferocious. At least he's not attacking the Swedes. Okay, we need to create a main character in Sweden. But no one really stands up. Maybe we should just go with the king. The king is kind of swag, right? So this should be this should be the king of Sweden. So, Knugen. Excellent. This is Knugen. And I'm going to make it as accurate as possible. Ambitious? Probably not. Definitely attractive. Agile? Oh, yes. Fast. One-eyed for sure. Blessed bloodlust. Nah, not bloodlust. He's a bit more of a... He's wise for sure. He's more of a pacifist, right? He's peaceful. But not a complete pacifist, right? Not a complete pacifist. He just doesn't want to punch first. He doesn't like hurting people, right? He's a little lucky for sure. He's lucky. Strong-minded. He's also powerful. And... Uh, what else are you? I think that's good. Maybe shiny. Yeah, you're definitely shiny. Perfect. That is, uh, this is Knugan. Absolutely beautiful. <laughs> Thank you, chat. Dear Christina, Clicky is becoming wholesomely evil. <laughs> I feel like our kingdoms are doing surprisingly well. Right? Nothing has actually blown up yet, which is beautiful, even though we literally have Florida and Ohio. Like, that should be problem enough, but... And the holy... Oh, wow. So our, oh, we have an army! They've actually started making an army that doesn't have any weapons. They're just... They're just an army. <laughs> the captain of the army is 12 years old! Oh, my God. Uh, Adam and Steve, your, your values regarding child soldiers is, like, very questionable. Holy shit! <laughs> okay, that's not good. <laughs> I'm not so sure this is favorable in God's eyes anymore. Uh, uh, ooh, Gina is both attractive and has regeneration. That's very useful. Like, uh, like, smexy Wolverine, basically. Hell yeah. Alright, anyway. Um, so the army consists of one child, basically. Thirteen now! They're aging fast. It's, <laughs> it's a chunky, gluttonous, deceitful child. This is their army. This is the army of the Holy Owo, a gluttonous, deceitful child, 13 years old. Great. What could possibly go wrong? What could possibly go wrong? God damn it. Oh, okay, Ohio also has an army. What kind of mistake have you created? This is Ogohord, who's nine years old? Man, it just doesn't get better, does it? Holy sh- Okay, well, the captain of the Ohio army is nine years old um, and is savage can get bones and leather from fallen foes. So they literally create clothes from the skins of their enemies. It's like a sociopathic nine-year-old. Great. Good job, Ohio. Good job. Okay, Sweden, how are you doing? What's your army like? Here's Sweden's army. This is Gore, 15 years old. Okay, now it's less questionable. Like, this, this, this could happen in Game of Thrones. You know, that's fine. Florida also has an army. What, what's Florida's army like? This is... Um, who's wet, tiny, and blessed. 36 years old. 16 kids. Okay, this is not too bad. Here, here's like, here's a soldier. Here's a heckin' soldier. Good job, Florida. <laughs> it's at least better than fucking Ohio. Sociopathic nine-year-olds running around skinning people. Fuck. <laughs> oh. <laughs> okay. Okay, well, that's great. That is just great. Look at this. Here's Adam. How's Adam doing? You're, you're such a good boy, Adam. You're such a good boy. Personality militarist. That fits pretty well, because you could definitely punch a bear to death. Imagine Adam and Steve being given the sole purpose of populating the entire planet, only for news companies 20,000 years later to talk about how they were best buddies. Yeah, they were roommates. <laughs> oh my god, they were such besties. They, like, shared the same bed because they were besties. They had a child together, just like besties do. They lived together for 30 years, just like besties. They even got married because they were besties. Ha 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 ha, yes. And, and, then, and then when they died, they were buried next to each other because they were besties. Oh, look at that. The Holy Owo just have a new colony that's called Bideowo 4. Oh, it's four population. Otherwise, okay, it's a bit odd to have numerical numbers. Holy Roman Empire 5. It doesn't really have the same kind of uh, shebang in the name. I am the sociopathic nine-year-old. Great, West. Good to, <laughs> good to hear it. How's the, how's the sociopathic nine-year-old? Already 38 years old? No, it must be a different person. Must be a different. Or was that Florida? I don't remember. 
Where's Sweden's army? Here's Sweden's army. Now, Sweden is fine. It's just like a 18-year-old coal miner. It's fine. It's fine. Okay? That's... Oh, they have also expanded. Look, Sweden has a new colony called Apor. Hell yeah. Okay, let's check kingdom layer so we keep tracks on that. This this is really good. Florida is a little bit isolated. They definitely have the small the small starting island, but I also feel that Florida kind of needs to be a little bit suppressed. Uh, let's see now. So let's let's pop some some bushes down here. Let's give them some food. Mana from heaven to Florida. Mm? Everyone knows Jesus came from Florida, or well, at least uh, naked Florida elf did. Which is basically Jesus. Age 40. You still only have 16 kids. It was more impressive to have 16 kids when you were like 20. Now now you're falling behind, man. You're king now. Come on. Jesus. <sighs> I am disappointed. No, oh, that crocodile just ate a cat. Great. <laughs> anyway. Ah, Sweden. Holy Owo is definitely doing the best. They are expanding the fastest. I'm impressed with Adam and Steve's ability to breed. 39 kids! <laughs> Adam! Holy shit, dude! 39 kids! God damn! Steve, 44 kids! Wait a second. Wait a second. Adam and Steve don't actually have the same number of children. This means someone has been procreating outside of marriage. I don't know how to feel about this. The drama ensues. God damn. <sighs> Steve cheated. Yeah, Steve is a cheater. Who's the che I wish we could have family trees in this. Who's the who's the who's the cheate? Damn it. So glad finally catching a stream. <gasps> that is so sweet. Firmly grasp it. Welcome in and thank you so much for the five. You beautiful being this one. So Steve the cheater. Yeah, Steve, you nasty boy. 47 kids. He's not even he made 3 children. Well, we were ranting about him being a cheater. Damn it, Steve. Frick. Duh. This is turning to some Love Island bullshit, but biblical. Hmm. All right, how's Florida doing? Hello, Florida. Uh, where's your king? There's the king. This is naked Florida elf. Still only 16 kids. You're falling behind, man. You're falling behind. How's your ma how's your mayor doing? Actually, you're you're pretty you're pretty swaggy. You're only 19 years old. All right. <clears throat> I'm still uh, I'm still kind of concerned I'll eventually find some someone who's like 8 years old and has 15 kids. It's like, you know, god damn it. <laughs> okay, let's see how how is the army doing? Uh, actually, this army is not too bad. Look at this. They have some swag. God damn. I mean, they have no experience and no weapons, but you know, I guess I guess they can I don't know, spread COVID to people, maybe? Maybe that's a warfare strat. How's, how's our champ doing? Champion of Ohio. D you have actually killed six things. You have 27 kids. You're actually doing well. And you have a stick! This is the first weapon I've seen. It's a wooden stick. Where weapon? It was created by Oghord from Ohio 12 years ago. <clears throat> You're telling me Oghord created a stick? What, he snapped it off a tree? <laughs> Here's the legendary weapon that's been passed down in generations. Take good care of it, champion of Ohio. Grandpa, it's a stick. Ah. Oh. Yeah, how old is this world? Um, it's 26 years. Yeah, it's it's about a generation old now. That's pretty cool. Okay, how, how are... Steve? 48 kids, okay? Good, you start to slow down a bit. Adam, 44 kids. You're catching up, okay? Well, you know, if you cheat equally much... <laughs> two wrongs make a right, right? <laughs> Uh, you haven't made Alabama, so don't worry. You, no, we haven't made it, but maybe Florida will split off into two. You know, don't uh, don't 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 worry about it, chat. Don't worry about it. We already have Ohio. It's bad enough. <clears throat> Slow down, Adam. Adam is a really little playboy. How are they? They have a big army. Look at this. Damn, what's the captain up to? Oh yeah, this is Pyomyo. That was like the 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 gluttonous, deceitful child that is not twenty one years old. You've actually had two kids. They're actually doing well for themselves for being a deceitful shit. Great. All right, Ohio. Um, Ohio seems to be doing quite well. I'm going to give some stuff to Ohio. Ohio, have a little bit of ore deposit. Your army is horrible. You have one stick. That's it. Have a bit of ores. Everyone get some ores. Here's a, a little bit of ores for the Swedes. A little bit of ores for the fl Floridans. And a little bit of ore for, uh, for the Holy Owo. Absolutely beautiful. It's going to be interesting to see who comes out on top. 
because uh, definitely Holy Owo has an advantage because they have the bigger land mass, right? So they will be able to reprocreate at a higher uh, velocity. Florida has a bit of a downside, but they're also isolated, you know? I would say these two, or maybe here, is most likely to clash first. Because, you know, Florida can actually boom down in the bottom of the world and still make... Oh, 69! Oh, nice. Hell yeah, holy obo. <clears throat> Florida has no trees? Oh no, it doesn't! I'm gonna make some trees. All right, let's see now, baby. Forest soil. Florida, thou hast been blessed with trees. I think trees should grow on this landmass. There we go. That looks relatively natural, doesn't it? Ah, absolutely beautiful. Do I have to seed this? Maybe. Maybe I have to seed this. Grass seed? Jungle seed, maybe? Let's pop some jungle seeds down here. That's cool. Let there be jungle! Look at that. Now they have trees. How beautiful is that? Wow. This is so beautiful, Florida. You're gonna have so much space and trees. Ah, maybe now they can build some boats. Hmm. There we go. Absolutely beautiful. Holy Owo is doing amazing. They even have a big army now. God damn. I wonder if Holy Owo is going to have some civil wars in the near future. <gasps> Wouldn't it be like the peak drama if if they have a rebellion and Adam and Steve ends up on different sides of the rebellion when the kingdom splits? <gasps> I'm already thirsting for the drama. Oh my god. I mean, they're already cheating on each other. I wouldn't be surprised if, if they do something dramatic like that. Adam and Steve? Mmm, 46 kids. How many kids do you have? 49, yeah, yeah, someone is definitely being a cheat little bish. Maybe both of them, you know? It's not necessarily just because one has more kids that, you know, that both hasn't been cheating. Steve versus Adam. <laughs> oh, the tea! I'm so in for it for the drama. Okay, where is, uh, where is Champion of Ohio? Where's our favorite? I'm not playing favorites, but where's our favorite? Maybe they're hiding inside a house. Let's go to our favorite list. I mean, they're definitely alive. Uh... Oh, they are actually expanding quite nicely. They have a whole new city. They have a, na they have a new mayor. Look at this guy. This is Digamore, age 50. Damn. Sweden is actually doing really well for itself. They're kind of catching up to Holy Owo. Oh, Ohio and Florida are falling behind. I mean, to be fair, Florida was kind of struggling with wood, so I have to had to do a little thing there. But like, yeah, Florida. I hope you. I hope we can keep up now. How do you feel about this naked Florida elf? You still only have sixteen kids. You're so bad. God, you need to get get on top of this, man. Jesus. Holy Obo is really just expanding. New Rock was founded. Oh, <gasps> wait. How many how many villages do they actually have now? Hold up, hold up. Village layer. Look at that. They have Giwawa. Budiowo and Nerok. And this is Torzog, Gior, and Apor. And then we have Amol Esson, which is uh, the city of, uh, <laughs> of Florida. <laughs> Great. <sighs> I made it to a live stream. Welcome in. I do hope you enjoy your stay. Burger. Oh, absolutely amazing. Holy Owo will start the first war for sure. I'm just hoping for the drama spice. I'm still hoping that Adam and Steve ends up on different sides of it. <clears throat> so this is Steve. Steve Steve has a golden tooth. I don't think I added that. And also wise. Steve is really badass. Damn. Do you have stick? <gasps> Steve has an epic stick. Created by Yotolo from Holy Owo seven years ago. What about Adam? Abaddon doesn't have any weapons, which is weird because he's like the warrior, right? He should have the weapon. Mm, let the drama ensue. All right, Holy Owo is definitely going to do something stupid soon. Anyway, Sweden is almost ca caught up to it in terms of population. They are doing really well. Wow, Sweden. How is how is, how is Knugan doing? This is Knugan. 34 kids, not bad, man. Not too bad. He also has a stick. Fascinating. Let's, let's check the cultures. So this is the culture of Sweden. Thegudum. They can make uh, sticks. They can make sharp sticks. And they can make two tiers of houses. Well, that's great. Let's see. Uh, culture list. So these are the different cultures, right? So this is the elven culture, a.k.a. Florida. <laughs> and they can make swords. But it can only make tier 1 houses. So, Bagdak, <laughs> which is the culture of Ohio. <laughs> yeah, it's about the same. Like, most of them are about the same level of, like, Stone Age, essentially. So, so that's roughly to be expected. <clears throat> 
love the names. It's beautiful. I think this is a beautiful, beautiful world. You know, I'm a pretty good god, if I may say so myself. Oh yeah, we have little gold islands out here. What is this? There are foxes here? I didn't place foxes. Oh, <gasps> look. The, the world out here is just teeming with life. Look, we have you, which is a fly. Uh, and then we have another ooh. Oh, we have ooh, and we have ooh. Great, and we have ooh. Okay, they're, they're basically the same name with different amounts of E's and W's. Splendid. Damn, holy, what was almost at a hundred people? How many babies do you guys have now? 51! <laughs> Half the kingdom are di basically direct descendants of, of Adam and Steve. Sweden is at a hundred. Sweden, for a moment, I think, yeah, look, Sweden, for a moment, bypassed Holy Owo in population. Now they will probably fall behind, though, because they're out of space, but... Damn. I just found the stream. How long has it been going on for? Uh, 54 minutes, but a bit of starting talk. So gameplay, maybe half an hour. <laughs> Why were those names so funny? I think... Okay, chat, let me know. Out of our current favorites, who is your favorite character? Out of the favorites we have currently, there is St Adam and Steve, which are which are the, the king and mayor of the Holy Owo Empire. We have Knugen, which is king of the Dwarven Kingdom of Sweden. We have Champion of Ohio, which is the champion of Ohio. And we have Naked Florida Elf, which is the king of Florida. <laughs> who's, your, who's your favorite, Chet? Tell me who your favorite is. <laughs> Oh my, a couple of people are saying Knuggen, not a Florida elf, champion of Ohio. Hell yeah. Man, I like this. It's like a good diversity of people we're rooting for. I'm actually going to do a poll. Can I do a poll? Maybe I have to do that in the browser. Hold on. Let's see. I'm going to make a poll <clears throat> and see who the favorite is. And I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to see who the favorite is. Engage with your audience. Start a poll. Who is... Who is your favorite character? Um, yes, no. Okay, I'm gonna bring up the list again so I don't forget anyone. We have Adam and Steve. And then we have Knugen. I hope I can add all the options. Then we have Champion of Ohio. Champ of Ohio. And then we... Oh, wait, no! Wait, I can't add more options? Okay, then Adam and Steve will be as one. Because they're a couple, right? So it's fine. Adam and Steve. And then we have Naked Florida Elf. Florida Elf. Champ of Ohio, can we get... Yeah, that's perfect. Which one is your favorite? Boom. There you go, chat. Let me know. There's a poll right now for who your favorite champion of our world is. <laughs> I'm looking forward to see who wins. <laughs> so beautiful. So beautiful. A lot of people like the naked Florida Elf. <laughs> Isn't that just beautiful? <laughs> Who doesn't like naked Florida elves? Look at that. He has the smallest kingdom. But that doesn't that doesn't mean his ego is hurt, Chad. That doesn't mean his ego is hurt. Champion of Ohio, only 11%? I thought cha the Orc Champion of Ohio would have a higher rating. Where is Orc Champion of Ohio? I haven't seen you in a while. Where is Champion of Ohio? Hold on. Hold on. Champion of Ohio, where are you at? You're just hiding in this house. You poo. 57 years old. Damn. Someone is someone is going at it. Hell yeah. <clears throat> it's not about the size click. It's about how naked you are, right? That's that's the that's the, <laughs> that's the <laughs> Naked Florida man is is also has bloodlust and is honest. Man, naked Florida man is just amazing. What a character. Everyone loves Naked Florida man. How's Adam and Steve? Adam and Steve. Uh, how many babies have you made? 48. Okay, they've actually started to slow down a bit. 53, yeah, you know. <gasps> Steve has a wooden sword, twisted razor blade. Legendary weapon. Wow. That's really cool, Steve. Do you have a weapon? Adam, who's the warrior, still does not have a weapon. And they have an army down here as well. They're, they're, I feel like the tension, holy oh, oh, are icing, right? Oh, this is the, yeah, that's the captain of the army. Okay, so Naked Florida Man won with 46% of the votes, Adam and Steve, 28% of the votes, Knugen, 14, and Champion of Ohio, 12. I'm surprised Champion of Ohio didn't rate higher, honestly. I thought Champion of Ohio would do more, but I suppose Naked Florida Elf is, uh, is the way to go. 
Damn, Naked Florida Elf, half the chat is rooting for you. Uh, don't die. Just because they are so popular and beautiful, I'm gonna create a separate island for them. Like, like a next place of advancement, if you will. I will bless them because they get, bring my chat views. So, <laughs> I'm gonna create a beautiful round island here, like a little paradise in the middle of the ocean, right? And we are gonna make this into hmm, jungle seeds, arcane desert, swamp, enchanted biome. I have no idea what this does. That sounds cool. This is now an enchanted biome. That's really badass. And there's a very small, maybe hills. Low hills, a lot of stone can be found here. I think hills is a good way, because I don't think they build on hills. So this is going to be a perfect pathway. Here we go, baby. I'm Oh, wait, before we do that, I'm also going to bless this with some rare materials, right? Here we go. Just, just a little mix of everything so they can use it eventually. A little bit of stone, a bit of ore deposit, a little bit of food as well. So people who come here to dig can just, can just eat some berries. That's very cute. And then we just create a small little pathway. Boom. I hope they can walk on that. I'm not entirely sure. <laughs> we'll find out, I suppose. Can you guys walk on this? They can! <gasps> oh, here's another naked man. Perfect. This is a Oeas, a 31-year-old naked fella who is very f stupid and attractive, very fast and strong. This is basically the ultimate gym bro. Gym bro. Excellent. Gym bro, you have a star as well. <laughs> Should I make Jim bro immortal? <laughs> what do you think, chat? Should Jim bro be immortal? <laughs> Don't let Alex and Eve find out about Steve and Adam's love. Also love your content and you. Thank you so much, Sandman. You're beautiful. Yes. Okay. Oh my god. <laughs> Jim bro should be immortal. All right. Jim bro, I'll give you some basic survival tools. Just like you're immune to disease and that kind of stuff. Nothing more though. You have proved that you can survive in this world. Um, but I should also do this as well. Uh, Florida. Florida Jimbro. Excellent. Florida Jimbro is going to explore the new island I gave them. And hence he has been blessed. Can I make you blessed? Yeah, you're blessed. Perfect. Look at that. He is conquering this himself. New village Oton. <gasps> is he the mayor? Uh, maybe not yet. Maybe they need some time to decide who the mayor is. I'm rooting for you. I'm rooting for you, Florida Jimbro. God damn, what a beast. Okay. <clears throat> Sweden is doing well. There's a lot of lightning strikes. Where is that happening? Holy Owo is really going at it. God damn. Where is the... Oh, this is the lightning cloud, I think. Is this the storm cloud that's coming in over the world? It's like raining here. I guess so. Holy Owo Civil War? What? Oh no, not yet. I don't see one. There isn't a village that has rebelled yet. <clears throat> Make war? No, no, no. No, no. We don't do that kind of stuff. They will fight on their own, Chad. Don't worry about it. They will bicker because they're humans, you know? Someone will cheat on someone, like Steve! And uh, they'll, they'll go at it. How is Jimbro doing? Jimbro? <gasps> Florida Jimbro is doing amazing. He hasn't become a mayor yet, though. I'm a little bit disappointed. Ohio is doing a bit bad. Yeah, Ohio. I don't know what's wrong with Ohio. The king sucks. Champion. Wait, champion of Ohio is king? God damn. No wonder it's doing horrible. <laughs> you weren't supposed to be like royalty. You were supposed to be like some kind of pit fighter. God damn it. Okay, well, fine. <sighs> so the champion of Ohio is now king. <clears throat> that explains the lack of performance. We could also do this. Ohio, I'm going to give you a small boost. This is your chance to prove that you are in fact worthy. I'll give you a small piece of islands here. Beautiful islands that you can populate in your name. Look at this. My god, this this little Od Odord is coming to colonize. Wow. Amazing. This has been found. Oh my god, the holy Owo is moving down into the south. I think the lightning strike hit her or something. Look out for the rhinos. They're they're nasty. Look out, Adji. You 12-year-old colonizer. <laughs> no, don't. God. Did anyone teach this 12-year-old not to punch rhinos? God. Is this their... Yeah, this is their army of like... Oh, God. Please, Adji, no. No. Oh, this, oh that's so tragic. Not even close. Oh, they just keep... A 9-year-old. 
This is Buha, the paranoid tiny nine-year-old. Great. They keep sending in the kids to kill the rhino. <laughs> I'm not so sure if I agree. Oh, this is 15 years old. Nice, it's getting better. Holy fuck! Someone has something fell from the sky. It was a meteor. Did you hear that? It landed right here. It almost hit the rhino. Holy shit. Okay, but this colony died, though. This colony got wiped out by the rhino because they only sent nine-year-olds. They got stomped to death. That is horrible. <laughs> God, people suck. <laughs> Sweden is... Ohio is still kind of poopy. Florida is really... Florida is doing well. They just jumped on the opportunity. Look at Jimbro. He just jumped on the opportunity. Jimbro is just nakedly mining all the ore I placed for them. Look at this. What an absolute champ. Holy shit. That's beautiful. Rhino said not today, colonizers. He stumped them all. This rhino has 14 kills?! This rhino is a veteran warrior. <laughs> they sent a dozen children just be like, ah, colonize the south. It's gonna be fine. And this rhino just came in and stumped all the kids. Okay, this rhino is a chosen one for sure. You're now immortal and <laughs> you know, all that kind of stuff, right? You also have a bit of bloodlust and you're blessed and attractive. This is a sexy rhino, okay? This is a sec- It's a bit slow though, right? It's tanky, right? So this rhino is a little bit slow. It's very chunky and powerful. And it's also small! <gasps> it's a small rhino, look at- Oh, it's tiny, bloodthirsty rhino! Amazing! Okay, what else? You also need to be, uh... You also- you also have an eye patch. That's pretty cool. And I'll name- what should I name the rhino? Horny. <clears throat> this is Horny, the cho- Horny! Um... Defender of the... South. That's pretty good. That's Horny. <clears throat> Oh, look, they're sending more kids. This one is a stupid 15-year-old. <laughs> they're really good. They're just sending children. One on one to die. <laughs> oh, oh, here's a pack of kids. Oh, that one died right away. This one is eight years old. Attractive genius content. I'm sorry. Why, why does an eight-year-old have an attra attractive trait? Ah, oh, this 10-year-old has nothing. It's not particularly gifted. All right, here we go. Well... Oh, great. Yeah, all the kids are dying. How about this one? This is a good little... Tough pacifist. 10 years old. That's not very pacifist! You're literally running up and punching him in the... Okay, well, you deserve to die. Freaking... They just they just keep sending the kids! That That's why Holy Owo isn't expanding. They're just sending children. Look at this. Oh my god. 17 years old. Okay, now now we're getting somewhere. Honestly, Horny is doing- <laughs> Horny has killed 21 kids! <laughs> Look, they just- <laughs> They're just trickling in kids! <laughs> <laughs> this rhino is level 4! <laughs> oh my, he's a veteran fighter! <laughs> Ah, here comes an attractive 12-year-old who's uh, who's coming in to, <laughs> to fight. <laughs> wow, that, that went... Okay, well, this doesn't seem to be changing anytime soon, right? Oh, there's also Buffalo. Billy Tor is here. Great. Okay, that hasn't actually killed anyone. All right, well, splendid. Eventually, eventually I suppose, Horny will... will yeah, Horny is kind of running out of health. Horny... Don't let the kids overtake you, okay? Oh my god, you regenerate health so well. Wow, you're a healthy boy. Okay, let's check out... Ohio, you suck! I gave you all this land to conquer, and you're still just, like, pooping around in your village. I think it's Champion of Ohio's fault. You, you haven't even made a lot of kids. You suck, and your favorite food is burger. <sighs> Could never relate to that. <gasps> oh, yes! Jim Bro, Florida Jim Bro, is the mayor of... of... Uh, of uh, Oton. Great. Do career. From a gym bro to mayor. That's like the typical, you know, Ar Arnold Schwarzenegger kind of kind of career right there. That is, that's freaking amazing, man. God damn. Mm. Send him a message. Yeah, Ohio isn't doing too well. How about this? Here's Ohio's army. 
You have angered your god. Zap. Take that burn, all of you. You have angered me? Don't focus so much on military, you don't even have weapons. You haven't even developed- Ooh, was that an immortal one? Oh my- look! Some of these ones are immortal. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Wow, they're like naturally doesn't age. Well, some of them are burning to death. I mean, sure, try to immortalize that. Uh, my best friend and I watch all of your OT and Jamie's videos to get over Discord. We're getting one demon for me, one for my daughter, and four for me. That is so sweet, Zelda. That is amazing. I'm so glad to hear it. I do hope you enjoy it. That is so good. Click is a fickle god. Well, Ohio pissed me off, okay? I'm, I'm not petty, but... Damn. There were a couple of these that were, like, immortal, though. No clue where they went, though. Maybe they got struck to death. How are you doing, Champion of Ohio? Now you have a legendary stick. Son of Buck Duck. Created by Azag from Ohio <laughs> two years ago. The legendary woodsmith. <sighs> Something is... that's not me. I mean, I kind of like Florida. Because Florida is like the tiny kingdom. that are not too eager to overcompensate, but they're very grateful for everything I give them. Ohio are just piece of shit. Okay, wait, now they finally started expanding. Okay. With a bunch of orc kids down here. Oh, that's great. That's that's just perfect. You have you have a pyromaniac. Wait, you have a pyromaniac you sent down to build the village? <sighs> Alright. Well, let's see how that's gonna go. Your favorite horny defender of the south has been slain by Filur. <gasps> Filur! You slain you killed Horny? Wow, the champion. God damn. Alright, you need to be immortal. I'm not gonna give you anything else though. Maybe bloodlust. And I was going to rename you to, like, uh, <clears throat> Horny <laughs> Slayer. <laughs> That's your new name. Enjoy. You're now blessed by God, which is me. You're also literally blessed. I'll also, I'll also, uh, make you shiny. Just so you, like, sparkle a bit. Sparkle? Did I pause it? Oh, yeah, I did. Now it's sparkling. Ah. <sighs> Just running around sparkling. You have been chosen by God. Enjoy yourself. How is naked Florida elf doing? 74 years old. 19 children. Good, stable family. Has a wooden sword. I feel like Florida is doing quite well. They have a windmill. Wow. They're doing so well. Oh, look at this adorable king. They have a boat. Oh, they have a little fishing boat. Oh, and here's Florida Jim, bro. Wow, that is so cute. Hi, lol. This stream is wild and I love it. This is Dotless. Welcome in and thank you so much for the isk. You beautiful bean. This one is offering. Mwah. All right, let's see. Ohio are kind of doing better. Maybe me smiting their chil children army taught them a lesson. <laughs> Don't mess around. Reprocreate faster. <laughs> okay, anyway. Uh, the Holy Owo. How are Adam and Steve doing? You haven't checked in in a while. This is Steve. 56 kids. 75 years old. Legendary wooden sword. Great. And Adam is up here. Oh, he has a stick now. Bill, big Palka. Was created by Ulba. Uba. 75 years old. Yeah. And there's their army. How's their army? Do they even have weapons? I see a couple of sticks here. Like these two fellas have sticks and wooden swords. Great. Okay. Well, that's cool. And they're actually colonizing the south. Oh, <gasps> here's a. Oh my god, look. Our favorite is here. Th this is Horny Slayer. Wow, just down colonizing the south like a beast. And here is uh, here is the <laughs> strong and wise buffalo fanger, who's, who's stomped one child at least, but doesn't seem so aggressive. I think they can get along with fanger. That's pretty good. <laughs> Children army, yeah. No, the, the the civilization have this tendency of recruiting like eight year olds. You know, uh, this is actually forty. Oh yeah, here you go. For example, this is part of. Discord. This is Discord, an orc warrior, age 7. Um, favorite food, burgers. They like their Happy Meals. They're also paranoid and savage. And gluttonous. Okay, so they just eat food and they create leather out of their enemies. Splendid, you see? Absolutely lovely. Absolutely lovely. Alexis, such a lovely voice. Thank you so much. Welcome and I do hope you enjoy your stay. I mean, age is weird in this game. Yeah, of course it is. I'm just I'm just glad there isn't like a feature where you know, oh this this six year old has fifty kids you know, <laughs> yikes. Okay, uh, wooden stick. Damn, look at this. They have an army now with like proper weapons, and when I say proper, I mean sticks. Holy crap! How's the how's Knugan doing? Where is Knugan? 
Knugan is over here. Here's Knugan, inspiring his, his forces. Damn, Knugan is a heavy toothpick? That is an amazing weapon. He literally has a giant toothpick. You should punish the leader, not the people of Ohio. Well, you see, you logically that makes sense, but I, I don't care. <laughs> this is Champion of Ohio. Man, Champion of Ohio, you're very quickly turning into the villain of the story. I am surprised that the Holy Owo has not had a civil war yet. That is amazing. I, I'm impressed with the leadership of, uh, of, uh, of, of Adam and Steve. I suppose Steve is the king. Steve has a bow! A wooden shadow strike, legendary weapon. Wow. He's even smart enough to keep his distance from battle. How is Adam doing? Adam still has this uh, nice wood stick, which is a legendary weapon. Splendid. <clears throat> I mean, Florida is just thriving. They don't have the biggest civilization, but they're just thriving. Look at this. That is adorable. I, I want to give them another island. I want to give them something cool. Because I really I really like them. They're, they're doing a good job. Florida, I thought you were going to be a cursed pile of shit, but you're actually doing well. All right, what should we place here? Mushroom biome. Enchanted seeds. Savannah seeds. Maybe like... Uh, I think they have a small jungle biome. Candy seeds. Crystal. Crystal biome sounds cool. That sounds pretty blessed, right? I guess they'll give them some cool resources. Yeah, look at that. Crystal trees and shite. That's really cool. Now we just need to create a little bridge. <clears throat> and I'll do the same thing. I'll create a hill bridge so they don't build on the actual bridge and block it off. Ohio, people of... Oh, wait. I'll do this first. I'll just give you a crap ton of food. Oh, wait. There can't be food here, apparently. A lot of silver. Do you guys like silver? Have some silver. There. You you have proven that your leader, despite a lot of doubt, naked Florida elf, was a really good bean. So, there you go. There you go, naked Florida elf. Your kingdom has been blessed. Look at this naked person running out here. This naked elf. This is chill. A 17-year-old naked person running towards the silver mines. Splendid. <laughs> Florida will make good use of all the crystals, I'm sure. Indeed. Look at them go. They're just fighting each other. Here's a random Beckbok. Oh. <laughs> Maybe. Oh my! It has 150 damage! The frick is this thing? Well, that didn't go well. Maybe you should uh, not like run in with uh, with naked uh, naked kids to try to kill it. It's not really working. Don't make the same mistake the Holy Owo did. Now yeah, they're doing the same thing Holy Owo did. Uh, that's great. You know what? Because I am a great god and stuff. Zap, zap. Ah, I died. Perfect. I'm a good god. The little shit is dead. Go forth and and do stuff that's cool. Oh, look, the Holy Oak is expanding into the south. They're, they're, they're sending kids to kill another rhino. Aw, oh, the rhino's crippled. That's sad. Wow, that is so sad. Look, it's just like a party of, like, high school girls just smacking the shit out of this rhino. Wow, that is so sad. Anyway, um... <laughs> Holy Oak is massive! God damn! Look, they're even expanding up north now. Into Sand Canada. Damn, that's cool. Look at that. Ohio is... Meh. Sweden kind of stagnated a bit. I mean, they're doing fine, but they're not really doing anything super interesting. Florida is just... Yes. They are struggling to expand here a little bit. Maybe it's because there's just so much resources here that they need to clean it out a bit before they can actually colonize. Oh, well. They'll get there eventually. <clears throat> How's Jimbro doing? Jimbro? Oh, <gasps> He has a sword! Wow. Hello, click Super Stream. What's the game called? It's called World Box. You can get it on Steam. It's like 20 bucks or something like that. 10 bucks. I don't know. Um, <clears throat> really fun. Really fun to mess around with. I love creating like silly stories for the people in the world and just kind of watch them duke it out. <laughs> it's amazing. <laughs> I had another world that I created that uh, I accidentally created a zombie apocalypse in. And there was one person who like survived it. So... The world consists of different islands, and the big main island had a zombie apocalypse. And there was one single survivor there who happened to have a really good bow and, like, immunity. So I, I named him Legolas, of course, and Legolas was just running around shooting zombies. It was amazing. Uh, then he died eventually and became a zombie, but, you know, it's, it was really fun while it lasted. <laughs> 
Sweden has stagnated quite a while. I know, right? Sweden, what are you doing? Disgusting. I think they need ships, basically. They need proper transport ships. That's when they will start expanding to the rest of the world. Are we actually mining anything? It's a bit unclear. They're a little bit confused, but I think they'll get to it. I believe in Florida. Right? Florida is a fan favorite. But look, what, this is such a cute town, though. Look, they have a little forest region, a little farmland. Here's, like, the, the, the mayor's house. And here's, like, the little village with Jim Bro. So cute. So freaking cute, man. God damn. How's, how's Sweden do? Sweden has actually developed roads. Look at that. Wow. Good job, Sweden. Hell yeah. Sweden is doing quite well, but they're very stagnant. Ohio... Mm, not really roads. They, 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 they kind of live in dirt huts still. <laughs> Ohio isn't very well developed. Uh -huh. <laughs> Champion of Ohio, you're not leading your people very well. <laughs> 88 years old. You have accomplished jack shit. All right. And holy OO is just blowing up. Look at this. Wow. Holy shit, Sweden just got hit by an asteroid. Oh, no. They got a bunch of rare minerals, though, but goddamn. Sweden. Oh, no. <laughs> that is atrocious. Oh, God. At least Knugan survived. Knugan is still alive. They can rebuild. They lost like 30 people, though. Damn. That was ruthless. What? Whew. They were nuked. Basically, they were nuked by space. Now, let's see if they can rebuild. I mean, they did develop roads, but... Yeah, they're starting to rebuild now. Wait, there's lightning strikes? Oh, no! Florida! Oh! What the hell? Oh, it's this cloud! Florida! Be care- Oh, God, be careful! Jim, bro, don't get struck by lightning. You're buff, but I'm not sure if you can take that. Uh-oh. Okay, I think- I think it's passed. I think the danger has passed. Village Hübleble was destroyed! Ah, oh, there is nothing here. I think just like, you know, one child walked up and got eaten by a bear. Basically. Alright, that's fine. New village er <gasps> Yeah, look! Florida actually made a mining village! Heck yeah, look at this. They're so- they're so good. They're so resourceful. Hell yeah, Florida. Ohio is kind of meh. Sweden is... They haven't even repopulated. They lost like 40 people in an asteroid strike. They did get some rare minerals, though, so when technology develops and I can actually use it, they're gonna be... they're gonna be ahead of everyone else. <clears throat> the living swords are evil. They are so strong. <laughs> Florida spread the crystal meth island. <laughs> Basically, look, they're building a little house there. Crystal meth and silver island. It's beautiful. Ah, oh, I love it. The Holy Owo. How is... how is... how is Adam and Steve? They have an army going up here. What are they doing? Hmm. Not really doing much. More naked miners, basically, yeah. I, in celebration of this going well, I'm gonna go get a beer. I'll be back in a minute. Don't... don't let the world nuke itself, chat. <laughs> I'm a responsible judge. <clears throat> All right. I have returned, chat. Oh, yes, indeed. Okay. Okay. No rebellions yet. That is good. That is good. Holy fly. Holy fly? No. Stop. 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 Cease. What about holy... What do you mean holy fly? God. <laughs> when the world goes well, click. God gets hammered. Ah, cheers, everyone. Mmm. Holy fly. What do you mean holy fly? Should I make a holy fly? Alright. First off, 
I'll make Monkey Island in honor of the game Monkey Island, the old classic. All right, let's see. So obviously jungle, jungle seed, there we go. And then we just need a fuckload of monkeys. Okay, I'm gonna click really fast, check this out. I am God! There we go, beautiful. Take care, monkeys. Oh. Killian, thank you so much for doing the last of squad. You're beautiful being this one. Mwah! Make holy fly. Can I even place a fly? Is that a thing that I can place? I can place a bee? A butterfly? Fairy? I'm not sure if I can make a fly. I know there are flies, but I can't really make one. Maybe I should just turn the- you know, the, you know the flies up here? Oh, maybe they're no longer here. Maybe they died of old age. Ah, oh, here we- here are a couple of bugs. What is this? This is- ew. <laughs> I'm not sure if this is a fly, though. It's more like a tick or something. Ew. And ew. I like ew. It's simple. Let's make a holy ew. Everything. You're a dragon slaying, evil, death bombing, <laughs> fat fireproof, healing aura. <sighs> you can also be strong, and I want you to be tiny. There we go, that's amazing. Look at that, it's so tiny now. Wow, that's a holy fly. Holy ew. Ew is holy. 35 health for ew, and that's pretty good. Well, good luck, ew. Sweden is kind of repopulating a little bit. I am still surprised there hasn't been any rebellions in holy oo yet. I'm very surprised. <laughs> I love this game. Hell yeah. It's such a good game. Where's the- Oh, no! Ohio is getting struck by lightning. Not enough lightning. Oh, no! What a shame! Ah, Look at that. What a- what a- what a- what a rascal. <laughs> Ohio, you make me ashamed of creating you. God, that's- that's harsh. It's like, you know, I'm not proud of you, child. That's dark. I say Comet was from rival God aiming for you. What? That is outrageous. Go. How is Champion of Ohio doing? Almost a hundred years old. How is Adam and Steve? They are the oldest creatures. They're also 99 years old. Adam and Steve are the oldest creatures in this, in this world. Is this Steve down here? No, that's Adam, right? That's Adam. With his curvy crudgel stick. Excellent. They're actually, they're actually developing some serious seafaring. Damn, I think they could actually colonize some of the islands pretty shortly. Because there are a couple of gold islands up here. There's Monkey Island you can take over if you like. <laughs> and then, what else? Like, there's a couple of, top, couple of small things here, still not colonized. We should make some more islands. Just to make sure they have, you know, something to strive for. Forest soil, excellent. This is make a few like islands that's worth colonizing, right? Like this. Oh, I know what I want to do. I want to do a hell. I want to make hell. Hell can be up here in the corner. That's excellent. So I'll just make hell like this. This is going to be hell. So it's going to be surrounded. It's going to be very difficult to take over hell. It's going to be surrounded by mountains, like a wall, like this. And then there's just going to be a small gap here where you can enter hell, right? A small beach where you can land. And then there's gonna be fiery towers that spawn demons. A little bit spread out along hell like this. This is a really nasty place. <clears throat> this is really nasty. Um, I'm also going to place... Let's see, jungle seeds. So let's just place some of this so we get some burnt trees. That's always cool for... Um, <clears throat> for environmental effects. There we go. Excellent. Look at that. This is hell. Oh, yes, indeed. Absolutely glorious. Let's see, what else? Um, I think that's pretty good. I want to I wanna create some more mountain stuff. Like this. Make it tricky to ascend this, you know? So the mountains are a bit spiky and inconsistent. You know, that's, that's just a random wall. There we go. That's pretty good. Just looks a little bit more natural. <clears throat> Excellent. And then we just have it like higher. Here's the only way to approach. 
Uh, sand. I want to make some sand here, so it's like a, like a small beach to land on, and that's it. Wait, 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 wait. What was that? What was that? Something blah blah blah. Bring chaos. I completely missed that. What was that? Important events. World history. A wild mage named Gajoch has appeared to bring chaos on this world. Where is Gagosh? Gagosh is attacking Sweden. Gagosh, what are you doing, Gagosh? Oh, okay. I'm gonna favorite Gagosh. Gagosh. He's just- he's just burning Swedes! Oh! Please, Gagosh! I mean, he's getting slapped with st he's getting really slapped. I wonder if Gagosh is gonna die. If so, someone should get its staff. They can be a chosen champion of Sweden if they get the staff. God damn, the go- they're just pushing him into the ocean. Is he actually dying? He's almost dead. Unless he teleports- Oh, <gasps> He died! Look! This person got a staff. Gul Gukum is skin burns and mage slayer. They have absurd Frank. <laughs> That's the name of the weapon. Absurd Frank. Hell yeah. That's beautiful. Okay. You are now blessed. You are immortal now and you're strong and all that kind of stuff. You're also shiny. I think that's pretty beautiful. I also make you attractive. There you go. What should I... Uh, you're Gandalf. But, but Swedish, so... Gen... Delf... Perfect. This is Gandalf. Because he killed an evil wizard and took his stick. So now he's like the chosen Swedish wizard. Excellent. Chat's been trying to tell you, civil war isn't on. It's not... Wait, hold on. World loss. I think civil war should be on. No? Which one is civil war? Rebellion. Cities can rebel when they have low... Yeah, rebellions are on. It is on. Again, det är alltid grej. Yeah, exactly. It is on. It's just that the kingdom has been really successful. It's very interesting that we haven't had any rebellions yet. Because you usually see the first rebellion at like maybe 100 pop, something like that. <laughs> there is a hell biome, I know, but this is also kind of just hell. <laughs> Let's see. I, I guess yeah, we can plant uh, we can plant some seeds for it. It is infernal seeds. This is the hell biome. So let's just plant a few of these bad boys. So this one grows into like a full blown hell biome. Excellent. That is beautiful. We can also just do this to speed up the process a bit. <laughs> Beautiful. Look at that. Hell yeah. I mean, literally, hell yeah. <laughs> this is now hell. <clears throat> I'm also going to place a shit ton of valuable resources here. Just like adamantite, the best metal in the game. Just fuck loads of this. So if someone actually braves it to hell, they will basically be able to conquer the world with the resources. But... They have to fight their way through really powerful demons, like Erev here, with his hot tongue weapon. It's pretty sassy. Or Balimon, with screaming flame. Goddamn, that's pretty hardcore. <clears throat> What's with the rest of the unfinished islands? Oh yeah, yeah, we didn't finish them. We got, we got distracted by hell. So, I'm thinking these ones should be pretty basic. Right? I was thinking, like, one can be like a jungle island, that we just let grow naturally. Uh, this one can be Arcane Desert. That sounds cool. And this one can be Lemon Island. That's pretty nice. Just some random resources. Because stuff would spawn naturally anyway. So that's pretty That's pretty nice. And then we have a Monkey Island in the middle. <laughs> this is colonized by monkeys. Ah, maybe, maybe this one should be full of uh, frogs. There's the frogs. Excellent. They will thrive. Well, Sweden has kind of recovered after the meteor strike. That's very nice. How's Knugen doing? 110 years old. New village. Oh my god, look! They're seafaring! The Holy Owo is actually seafaring! Look at this! They have colonized this island with Hekebeb, 12 years old, and Nukat, 29 years old. That's fucking weird, but damn! They actually- they're colonizing islands! Oh, That is so cool! That is amazing. Look at that. They're actually seafaring. Hell yes. 
How's Florida doing? Florida already sucked up all the minerals I gave them. I'm expecting Florida to have some big, like, power spike in technology. A stone spear. Thirsty impaler. <laughs> okay, well, spike in technology might have been like a slight exaggeration, but all right, fine. So holy oh, 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 we haven't checked in with Adam and Steve in a while. Steve has now 60 kids and is 111 years old. And uh, Adam is down here somewhere. I think he's vibing in a house. Where are you, Adam? There you are. Boink! Yeah, he's inside a house. We can just view his profile here, though. Bam. 55 kids, 111 years old. How are the rest of our favorites doing? Knugan is doing fine. Champion of Ohio is poopy. Naked Florida, man. We haven't checked in with you in about 22 kids. You're doing it, man. You're doing... Hell yeah. I'm so proud of you, boy. And then we have Gandalf, which is over here. You're so good. So good. Mage Slayer. Goddamn Gandalf. And then we have Horny Slayer. Horny Slayer is still alive. We haven't even kept an eye on Horny Slayer. This is Horny Slayer. The person who killed the rhino who was uh, blocking the south. Got a blessing from God. <sighs> yes, indeed. Click the emotional support team and hit over 11,000 plushies. Hope you know how proud I am. The permanent rascal. Oh my god. Really? Wait, wait, wait. Let me refresh the page. Hold on. Hold on. It's currently at... Oh yeah, look at that. It's actually... <laughs> I still have the browser up in this window. Whoops. Well, let's see. Then we can just show it. Look at this while I have it. 11,066 plushies. Holy shit. I'm gonna hide this again because it's kind of ugly, but... Damn. <laughs> it's almost, almost very close to being number two top selling of all time on Megship. That is insane. And it's like a third, not even a third of the campaign has passed. Phew. That is nuts. One thing I would like to do is have like a... Human Vun is in the chat. Welcome in Human Vun. We are playing God. It's absolutely amazing. I would recommend this game if you're looking for something cozy and cute to do on stream. This is the Holy World. Holy OO, which was founded by Adam and Steve. Then we have Ohio, that was founded by Champion of Ohio. Then we have Sweden, with the King of Knugen. And then down here, it's a fan favorite, which is Florida. With the King, a uh, naked Florida elf. It's a kingdom of elves. And then we have up here, which is the mayor of the expansion, which is Florida Jimbro, with the stone sword. Look at that, beautiful. I want a dragon island. Ah. By the way, chat, you should get an emotional support team, and if you haven't already, whoa! Link is in the top of the description. It is insane. The support is nuts. 11, oh my god, 11,066. That's what is that. 11,000 plushies. Ah. I thought it was going to sell about 4 or 5k. That was my estimate. That's what I thought it was going to be. No, I was, I was very wrong, and I had a bunch of challenges, and that was a mistake. All right, let's see. Sweden. Sweden has actually developed pretty good housing. Look at this. They have temples and stuff now. New village Dumb Harbor has been founded. Wait, who's this? Sweden is colonizing Monkey Island. Wow. That's really cool. They sent out a 63-year-old and... and a bunch of children. <laughs> how... how are you gonna... how are you gonna repopulate this? Sweden? Uh... Please? Dear God, okay. We're not gonna... Um, but civil war is on, right? How many... Wait, how many villagers do we have? How has nothing of this rebelled? I am astounded how peaceful this has been. How... How has the holy oh whoa kept together this long? That is insane. That is insane. Sweden is colonizing Monkey Island, so <laughs> they've invaded England! <laughs> chat, please. Chat, please. Force a war? No, chat. No, chat. We... We just... We just build up the tension, right? We're not the one who makes the push. That's the art of being God. I like Lemon Island, though. That's very cute. And then down here we have... Jungle Island, which is actually being populated by Florida. This is amazing. Every, every kingdom, except for Ohio, fucking Ohio, but every other kingdom is taking an island colony.
So Holy Awo is colonizing, uh, I don't remember what I called this, but miscellaneous jungle island too. <laughs> Sweden has taken Monkey Island. Florida is taking over miscellaneous jungle island too. And Flo Ohio has taken shit. Great. And then of course we have hell. Which is going to be really difficult for anyone to even touch. Right? No one is going to hell. I mean, I'm just expecting them to trickle in children, like they did in the south to the rhinos. Just gonna be like, oh my god, send two 12 year olds, they can do that and just die. <sighs> can't have islands in Ohio. <laughs> this is why we can't have... Maybe it's because they live in a lemon biome. Is, is that what, like, hinders them? But they have, like, wood and resources and stuff. They still live in huts. <laughs> what the fuck? Your culture is shit! I mean, you do have house tier 3 and you have, like, windmills and docks. You actually have armor production. You can actually make armor. Does anyone have armor? Do, do you even have resources to make armor? How did you develop it if you don't have resources? Ugh, okay, well, may, maybe Champion of Ohio has some. No, oh, Champion of Ohio is a really speedy boy. Actually, Champion of Ohio has some swag. I feel like... I feel like Ohio has just turned into like a dictatorship where every piece of resource and goodness is just funneled to Champion of Ohio as the, like, dictator of Ohio, you know? That's the way I feel about this. All right, well, that's that's the story of Ohio right there. How is Sweden doing? Has Sweden developed anything fun in its culture? Now, yeah, let's check it. So this is the culture of Sweden, Telgiddum. Yeah, a little bit more developed than Ohio. Um, they have, like, roads and stuff. They have house tier 3, which is the same. They have some swords and some boats. Ooh, they have barracks. Okay, how is Florida doing? About the same level of culture. They haven't really done anything more than Sweden. The Holy Owo is doing really well. They have houses tier 3 now. They have a bunch of ships. They have trading boats. They have watchtowers. They are doing insanely well. Look at this civilization. It's booming. I am just amazed nothing has rebelled. Honestly, like Holy Owo has kept it together really well. D d d shut! Shut! Damn, that is impressive. Ohio is still not colonizing anything. <laughs> they have barely invented sticks. <laughs> Make a new colony from one Florida and one Owo. Will it be Fawawida? <laughs> Oh, that's so bad. But there have been no civil wars yet. I am so impressed. I am so impressed. Usually by this time, it's just like complete and utter warfare back and forth. It's like, it's just amazing. Because because this is, rebellions is turned on. This is the only stuff that's not turn, turned on for good reason. Because it's like, ooh, angry villagers. It's like everything just runs in and dies. You don't even have stuff that captures and like limit the population of settlements by 100. It's also kind of like, meh. You want to leave it unlimited so it just can blossom. So, mm. check each village individually for its happiness. Okay, let's see. Village layer. So this is row, row, row. Uh, where's the happiness? Um, resources. How do you tell the happiness of a village? I don't know where the happiness is. I don't know. Customized kingdom. Oh, damn. Ha! <laughs> That's cool. Um, check diplomacy. Leader of this village kingdom. No idea where they haven't clashed. In the view kingdom menu. Okay. Um, list of all villagers. Uh, doesn't really say if they're happy or not. It's just the same menu, kind of. Right? Diplo is a setting. Eh. Nope. I don't know. We're just gonna- we're just gonna let them duke it out. They'll- they'll probably kill each other soon. <laughs> That's amazing. I clip what you said for my small mechie. <gasps> That is so sweet. Lost their little mind. Thank you for making their day in mind. That's so sweet, Savior. That is so adorable. Aw, thank you. It's a plus one click. Oh my god. 
It shows a list of the villages. Y yeah, that's what I was doing. Look, look, villagers list. And here are all the villages. You see? But, uh, but I don't see, like, a happiness anywhere, right? Or is this the happiness? Is, is the time? No, that's just how long it's been alive. And this is how much army it has. And that's how much land it has in population. I'm not sure where the happiness is. Hmm. Oh, wait, here it is. Here it is. Ah, this is loyalty. Oh, damn, yeah, they have some... Leader's mood, yeah, okay. So when this drops low enough, that's when they rebel. So Duran is the one that's the most likely. It's this one, it's the one in the south. That's the one that's most likely to rebel. Damn. We'll see how that works out for Holy Owo. How are the leader? How's Steve doing? Well, not much has happened. 60 children. Not bad. 56 children fall behind Adam. God damn. How's Champion of Ohio doing? I must say, though, I think Champion of Ohio is probably, like, the strongest uh, leader in the world right now. Like, physical strength. Oh, here's Gandalf! I love Gandalf. Such a good boy. How, how is Naked Florida Elf doing? Where is Naked... Is this Naked Florida Elf? Hell yeah! Naked Florida Elf is also kind of powerful, but not as powerful. I think Champion of Ohio would, would win, like, a one-on-one... -on -one combat, so to say, if we had a tournament. <clears throat> they usually rebel as the king dies. Not necessarily. Not necessarily. Diplomacy is in world rule. But but I've already checked that. Like, it's, uh, it's here. Random events, yeah. Exactly. Kingdom can declare war in treaties, rebellions, all that is, all that is turned on. The only thing that's turned off is these two, like that limits stuff. <clears throat> so I'm just surprised nothing has rebelled yet, because they really should, right? They really should. I saw Adam and Steve. What's up? Here's Adam and Steve. They have created... This is Steve. He has 60 kids. <laughs> He's amazing. And up here is Hell. How is Hell doing? It's basically just demons running around. I, I am looking forward to see whichever kingdom comes out on top. And... Uh, if, if anyone managed to capture hell, because there's only a small gap right here. And then there's tons of demons guarding it. And then just hellfire towers. <sighs> click spam, click the burger in settings to activate the debug menu where you can activate more stuff to check. <gasps> Wait, what? Burger in settings. Uh, I don't know what that means. You mean these things? Oh, this one. Oh, that's nice. Ah, oh, is that the debug? Ah, God mod, open developer console. Oh. <laughs> Excellent. So this is all the kind of like... Oh, damn, there's so much stuff. I'm not sure if I should touch a lot of this, because I barely know what this is. Oh, there's a Greg button. Okay, well, I'm going to wait with that. Anyway, anyway, chat. Here we go, baby. <laughs> Activate sonic speed. No, 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 we're fine. A wild mage. <gasps> oh, it's another evil mage. He's just getting completely, literally shit on by the monkeys. <laughs> it's just burning monkeys and shit throwing. That's the, the monkey island just is complete chaos. Is he gonna die? He just died. He was killed by a monkey. And a lot of monkeys die too. Human wants Canada land. You should make favorite demons named Mango and Owo Hefar. Will you please say hi to my daughter, Leandra? Hello, Leandra. How are you doing? I hope you're having an amazing day because you deserve it. She is nine. That is so sweet. I hope you're having an amazing evening. Oh, that is so cute. Welcome in. What a shitty death. <laughs> you mean because they literally died from, like... <laughs> <laughs> like 50 monkeys throwing poo at them. Holy oh, whoa, how have you not had rebellions yet? You are an absolute titan of a civilization. Damn. Everyone says it wrong, but he got it right. Yes. <gasps> the name? Oh, I'm proud of myself. I usually mispronounce everything. The girl I like is coming over Sunday so I can teach her what French Christmas is like in Florida. That is so sweet. 
That is so sweet. I do hope it goes really well. Christmas is an amazing, cozy time, and I wish you the best of luck. Give one strong gear. They will develop strong gear. They don't have the tech to do it yet. So, like, eventually they will develop armor smithing and stuff, and they will use the resources to do that. I kind of want Ohio and Sweden to fight. You know what? <laughs> it is time! You are my two least favorite countries, Ohio and Sweden. Go! Duke it out, you little shits! <laughs> I want to see them in action. I want to I wanna see champion of Ohio duke it out with Sweden. Oh, it's happening. It is happening. <gasps> well, almost. We have a couple of uh, Ohioic kids uh, running in here. Oh my god, they're... Oh no, they're fighting Crystal Doke. Well, they're gonna die. They're not very strong. Kingdom Florida has declared war on Ohio? Wait, Florida is fighting Ohio. I linked together Sweden and Ohio. What is, why is Florida fighting Ohio? They don't, they're not even adjacent. What? What just happened? Are they invading each other or something? Where are the ships at? Here, no, the, the, these are all Ohio, uh, Ohioan ships. The Floridocian ship. Oh, they're trading with each other. That's very cool. Are they sending an army to Ohio? Is that what these ships are doing? Or are they just trade cons? No, I think this is... Is this a military ship? It is, I think it might be. Oh my god, they're sending an army! Look at that, they're attacking Ohio! Florida is attacking Ohio! Oh my god! I wonder who's gonna win. I don't think either of the armies are particularly well equipped. They're basically just fist fighting. That the <laughs> I didn't lemon tree just grew in the middle. I am rooting for Florida, but I don't think their army is gonna survive this. Yeah, they got wiped out. They just sent one little transport ship of, of soldiers. They they need to do better than that. But they did wipe out a few Ohioans. Sweden is not at war with Ohio yet. That is fascinating. I wonder when the holy OO is gonna do something. <laughs> War! What is it good for? Absolutely nothing! Except for wiping out this. Okay, let's see. We have more ships coming in here. Is this a trade ship? Or is this also a military ship? I think it's a trade ship. It just went into the dock. Okay, okay. So Holy OO is just trading and booming. Holy OO is so powerful. And so peaceful. How have they not had rebellions yet? That is absolutely insane. You know what? I'm gonna turn it off and turn it back on. See if that resets something. Maybe, maybe the setting is bugged. Is some, oh my god, they're fighting again! Florida just dropped off another army in Ohio. Look at this, they're just duking it out. They have spears now, they have stone spears. Nah, they're not, they're not, they're just sending over too little at a time. Nothing is really gonna happen from that. I'm surprised Sweden isn't fighting Ohio, though. Because sometimes the kingdoms just gank up on each other. When they see one fighting, they just take the opportunity and they strike as well. I give all my nepe checkers tomorrow. Ziggy, you don't have to do that. Thank you so much, though. My god. I do hope you enjoy the stream. Okay, Ohio is kind of struggling. They're not repopulating fast enough. Wait, 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 wait. What are they doing now? What? Are, wait, Ohio is, atta is Ohio attacking Sweden? Wait, hold on. Hold on, is Ohio attacking Sweden? It looks like their army is moving in. Or are they moving to the ship? I think they might be moving to the ship. But they're moving, like, across Swedish land, so this is really weird. Oh, wait, no! The, okay, no, they're just attacking some crystal creatures. Okay, that's fine. The crystal creatures seem to be allied with the Swedish dwarves. So that's, like, a nice little natural defense they have. Yeah, they're going into the ship. I think they're... Are they sending a counterattack to Florida? Is that what they're doing, or are they going to colonize? It's one of the two. That's a pretty big army. They have, like, stashed a solid 30 soldiers into this boat. At least. Look at Lemon Island. Oh my god, what happened here? It just, it's just burning down. I think it got struck by lightning or something. That's not nice. Okay, how's the ship is just vibing there. They are still at war with Florida. I don't think anyone else is at war, though. It's just Ohio and Florida duking it out. 
But Florida is definitely doing better. I mean, it makes sense because Florida are elves and Ohio are orcs. And I think they naturally like hate each other more than the other factions do. Holy OO is chill. I know, right? It's insane. I don't know why Holy OO isn't breaking up in rebellions yet. Somehow, they have managed to maintain like amazing relations. This is the population that is the least like leader, distance, traits, minus 60. Like this village is the least happy one. But everything else is so happy. And I mean, even if this rebels, they're just going to be quelled right away because it's so small. Maybe that's why they're not rebelling, because it's too tiny. <clears throat> Maybe because they have angry villagers off? I don't think so. I played with these settings before. This is just that the villagers will hop in and fight, and not only armies. Which is kind of a shame, because then areas always get wiped out instead of, like, you know, taken over. So it's a bit of a, a, bit of a genocide setting. Oh my god, I think the Ohio is launching an assault. This is an Ohio warship. Are they going to go to Florida or are they going to colonize? What are they doing? Wait, they just... They just... <laughs> did he just go around Sweden? That's it? They just... <laughs> Plempkin, what nice ship. They just... Why? Why did you... <laughs> they just... They just <laughs> that was it. That is so weird. What? All right, whatever. Well, Florida is still doing really well. They have populated this island. Sweden has populated these two. The Holy Owo has a colony down here. I mean, Adam and Steve are just like rocking their kingdom. It is insane how well they have been leading it. I am impressed. If the kingdoms are the same race, they will conquer. But if they're distant races, orcs or elves, they'll destroy. Love the stream, by the way. Oh, that is very cool. Yeah, that explains it. Ah, so rebellions of Holy Owo, they're gonna try to, well, capture each other, but these- Oh my god, they're attacking! Oh! <gasps> yeah, they just- they just sent it right into the face of the champion of, of Ohio. That's not gonna work out well. That's a real beast of combat. I'm just surprised- Oh, wait, what is this? Wait a second, Ohio has sent, like, a force right into the Holy Owo. What are these up to? This is an entire attack force right here. They're not particularly well equipped. I mean, they're basically a bunch of naked orcs, but... <laughs> what are they doing there? Look, they're just vibing. Wait, they're going into a ship down here. They are so weird. Check on U. <laughs> U is up here, I think. Oh, it, the biome changed. I think U died. <laughs> Wait, did U die? No, U is alive! <gasps> U is alive! 57 years old. Hell, you look at U. Nice. Holy bug. It's lived so long that the biome on the home island changed. This is a bunch of random naked orcs running around in the middle of the Holy OO. I'm gonna make Ohio go to war with everything. <laughs> Force a kingdom to start a war! Ohio is now on war with everyone! <laughs> Look at this army duking it out. They have attacked the Holy Owo. Oh, I think their little army of naked orcs in the middle of the kingdom is gonna get wiped out. Look at this. Oh my god, that's not good. That is not good. <laughs> Take that, Ohio! <laughs> oh, look at that. The little attack force they had here is just completely botched. Oh, Sweden is moving in with a big army. Look at this. God damn. Champion of Ohio, you're going to have to defend your hometown. You have some pretty solid gear. You have a stick in leather armor. Like, damn. This could, this could be really challenging for Sweden to take on. If the champion of Ohio actually decides to join the fray. Because right now, Sweden is winning. Like, it's just a few stragglers coming in to defend the border. The lemon forest is falling into Swedish hands. Ohio's population is rapidly decreasing. Their little colonizing forces in the Holy Oo got wiped out instantly. Oh my god, Sweden is moving and is destroying the village. Oh my god, they have some big warriors with <laughs> with wooden swords though. Here comes the champion of the freaking Let's follow the champion. This is the champion of Ohio. Coming in to just duke it out with the Swedish army. 
I don't think they're gonna make it though. I don't think the champion of Ohio can hold this off by their on their own. They're getting ganked by like 30 people. They're really getting some solid shots in though. Look, they're just running around finishing people off. But now I think they're gonna die. Oh no, champion of Ohio. You're 149 years old. You were killed by a dual. I think Ohio is falling. The Kingdom of Ohio. Basically a disappointment from start to end. Well, they have this little thing left. They have they have this tiny colony. They're jumping into a ship. The King of Ohio. This is the new King of Ohio. Damn, you actually have some decent gear. All right, let's see how you do. They actually pumped a bunch of people into this boat right here. Are they going to make a run for it? Are they just going to colonize somewhere else and just get the frick out? But there isn't that much left to colonize. Like, there are a couple of small islands up here, and then there's hell. And there are a couple of tiny, tiny sand piles, but that's about it. I think these two are the best bet. Well, they did pump a few people into the boat, so even though the Swedish army is moving in, I think they should survive this. Because they're not going to hold this off. I mean, the, the mayor here is making a brave last stand. Urgazo. But but that's not that's not going to work. Yeah, that's his instant death. Completely ganked. <laughs> Poor Ohio. Oh, no. Come on, Ohio. You can do it. But Ohio still has 18 people left. 17. Ohio is making a run for it. <gasps> they're actually making a run for it. Look. This is the last ship with an Ohioan flag. Oh no! No, they landed by no by Florida Jimbro. No! Oh, Florida Jimbro is just gonna rip them apart. I think it would be so so tragic if Florida Jimbro dies to this. So this was their last attempt. Yeah, Florida Jimbro is holding the line easy. Look at this. Wow. Yeah, no, they're not they're not gonna survive this. I think Ohio is done for. Ohio is definitely... They did some damage, though. They're doing some damage, but... I do not think they will survive. Jim, Florida Jimbro is too powerful. Yeah, they smashed right into Florida Jimbro. This is not working out well for them. Him and his naked gym buddies are just, are just tearing Ohio apart. Ohio still has three people left. Wait, now also the Holy Owo has landed here with their own attack force. I think they got wiped out. I think Ohio is dead. Is Ohio actually dead? Did Ohio die completely? Ohio is still... Wait, Ohio still has two people? Wait, where? Where are they? Hold on, what? It says Ohio still has two population. Where's Ohio? Did they survive somehow? Where are they? Or is it just like a couple of random people left like in a corner somewhere? Or are they actually like on a boat with a plan? I have no idea where they are. They're not dead. We haven't gotten the message yet. They still have two population. Where are they? I have no idea. Sweden is populating old Ohio. Are they up here? No, these are just like the weird little lemon creatures. Where are Ohio? Center the boat? So there's supposed to be a boat somewhere, a yellow boat. Is it here? Is that the one? Oh, I think this is the one. This is the Ohio boat. Yeah, Kingdom Ohio. This is Plemkin. This is the last boat of Ohio. This one right here. Oh my god, so they actually survived. Oh no! No! Sail away! Ohio! Flee! Sweden is shooting us! Flee! I'm not sure if they have anywhere to go. Do they have anywhere to go? Are they just gonna... I, I want to see what their plan is. Because there is still, like, a little bit of islands up here they could go to. These ones have resources. 
it's kind of kind of cramped, but they do have resources. They could also go back and take some parts of old Ohio back, I suppose, but there are lots of armies here still, so that's very risky. They're still alive. They do not want to give up. I want to see if they manage to survive. This is interesting. <laughs> the Holy Owo is still doing amazingly well. I am fascinated the Holy Owo has not broken out in the Civil War yet. While we wait for Ohio to make a move, I'm going to see if we should... Because uh, this village was very... Very rambunctious. They are rebelling! <laughs> Duran has broken free and are now a kingdom of their own. Oh, yes, indeed. They are the new kingdom of the Gatui. I think they're just going to get wiped out. Look at this. That's what happened to dissatisfied villages. My god, look at this warfare. All hail King Horny. Horny Slayer became king! <gasps> Horny Slayer lived in Dundrun? What? Oh my god, that's amazing. Horny Slayer, hold your ground. You can create your own... Or, or don't run in and die, at least. You've had an amazing story. You were a child who killed the rhino. Well, that's pretty sad. I'm just turning into a porcupine. Well, Horny Slayer died. <laughs> maybe, maybe this is why the AI doesn't actually rebel by itself. I think they just wait until they have enough to rebel with to stand a chance, kind of. I think that's why. Because this was the only village that was unhappy. Horny Slayer died! <gasps> yeah, Kingdom Gatui was destroyed. Florida has declared war on Sweden? What? Florida and Sweden are duking it out? Oh no! Oh no! Wait, where did... Where did Ohio go? Did Ohio die? Hold on, hold on, hold on, where's Ohio? Ohio got wiped out! When did Ohio die? It must have died in the middle of the rebellion. Hold on, when did Ohio die? Ohio was destroyed. Same year as Horny Slayer died. Same year as uh, the very brief Kingdom of Gatoi died. Ohio is dead. Ohio lasted for 142 years. Rip Ohio, I would say GG, but to be honest, y'all kind of sucked. <laughs> the ground is shaking. Oh, there was an earthquake in the ocean. Okay, well, that's not that's not too impressive. So now Florida and Sweden are duking it out. Wait! Sweet, this this right here. I didn't see it because because I'm a little bit... Uh, th these t ones are hard to tell apart for me, these colors. I didn't realize that this right here, this peninsula, is a Florida colony. I thought it was all Swedish. Oh, no. They have, like, nothing here. Oh, no. How, how big is this village? They have three people! No! There's an arm... Oh, wait. Something is duking it. Oh, my God. Is this... Is this also Florida versus Sweden? I think it is. So Florida have a little army up here. Look at this. Who is this? Yeah, this is a Florida army. So they floated an army here to help defend their colony. That has three inhabitants. Five now. They've bred a little bit. But... Oh my god, Gandalf is here! Where is Gandalf? There's Gandalf! Gandalf? G the Swedish Gandalf is here just burning down the Florid Florida village. Oh my god, this is hardcore. <laughs> Oh no! Aid Florida? But I can't kill Gandalf! Come on now! I blessed Gandalf. I have to respect him. I mean, if he was starting to go after, like, uh, naked Florida elf, then maybe I would reconsider it. But, like, this? Who, who cares about Jigge Kefe Fohavetis? Like, they're dead. There's like two people there. There were nobodies. Come on now. Gandalf is immortal, he can't lose. No, no, immortality only means that you can't die from old age. You can still die if your hit, hit points reach zero. So it's just that the main characters won't just, you know, quietly die in a corner of the map. It's just a good way of telling the story, I think. Is Holy Owo going to war with anything? Not re Wait, oh my, wait, wait, what is this? Sweden is gonna uh, completely load the ship full with like three armies. Look at that. They have like three armies coming for this ship. Wait, what's going on here? Oh my- wait, Florida is taking Monkey Island? Yeah! Florida is taking over Monkey Island. 
Well, they're burning it to the ground. I'm not sure if they're colonizing it, but... Damn, boy. Oh, wait! The Holy Owo just declared war on Sweden. Oh, no! Is the Holy Owo gonna wipe out Sweden? Because the Holy Owo is a really freaking large empire. They have almost 200 army, while Sweden has 72. Florida has 60 army. That's not too shabby, but it's a bit less than Sweden. Oh my god, look, they're sending like three whole armies into the ship down here. Most likely to get it over to Sweden. Oh no. Sweden is so screwed. <laughs> they already like got this colony like completely burned to the ground. I think they're gonna lose it soon because there's nothing defending this colony, right? Let's see. Uh, village zones. Is this... Wait, it, God, it's... A, I, I think I need to recolor one of them. Hold on. Florida? I'll give you another color because I can barely tell this apart. Uh, customize kingdom. Kingdom's color. Yeah, there we go. Now I can actually tell it apart. Okay, so Florida has... Okay, no, so this actually belongs to Sweden, but why is... But Sweden doesn't have anything here. I guess there are still some people alive in like a boat or something that makes it stay alive. Anyway, let's see now. This is the big army ship of the Holy Owo. That is currently being loaded to go to Sweden. How, how is this kingdom doing, by the way, in terms of tech? They're actually coming along. They haven't really developed any like advanced smithing. But like... A lot of various weapons. Maybe they just need more resources. You will get a bit of a blessing. Uh, here's some adamantite. Here is some silver. Uh, ore deposit and some mithril. Enjoy. <laughs> I'm not playing favorites, but... I mean, Florida also needs a little bit of favoritism, right? They get some adamant. I'll give you a little bit of silver here. I'll give you a little bit of mithril down here. Hell yeah. Some gold, maybe. Why not some ore deposits? Uh, some stone to build stuff with. There you go, baby. That's very nice. Mine it all up. All right, Sweden. Mm, nah. <laughs> You're killing trees. Don't worry, they will grow back. <laughs> all right, here we go. The Holy Owo is launching an attack on Sweden. I'm not sure which the warship is. I think it's probably one of these ones, most likely. Oh, wait, here it is. They just landed with an army. It's not a very big one, though. But they do have some... Well, I'm saying some equipment. They have sticks. Everyone just has sticks. <laughs> I'm here. Hi, click. Hello, Charcoal. Welcome in. They're just duking it out. Is this another battleship that's coming around? Oh, wait a second. Look, Holy Owo already colonized Lemon Island. They're actually making it look quite nice. And they're also colonizing... What is this? East Old Ohio. No, the village got destroyed. Village Uno, Uno something something, a.k.a. East Ohio, just got completely wrecked. Sweden just took it back. Sweden is not fucking around. They sent an entire army boat and Sweden just punched it back. That's pretty bad. Look at this. This poor fella right here. A crippled person with a wooden stick. Ow. That, that's not... Oof, oof. That was not very strategic at all, was it? I mean, Sweden is somehow keeping this colony alive. I don't know how. Well, now they're just getting... Oh my god, here comes, here comes the Holy Owo army. This is a mix of Fl Florida men and the Holy Owo army right here. They're just kind of allying up. I think I think Sweden is trying to rebuild here. I think they have people who technically belong to this village. You see, because foundations keep popping up. So I think they have some people who technically belong to this village, but they're currently sitting in a ship or something. That's why it's not being captured. Oh, they're duking it out right here. Florida has just landed with an army. Are they well equipped? No, they have sticks. <laughs> but, but so does... Sweden. They have wooden spears and sticks. <laughs> oh my god, so he just got yeeted! Do you see that? This person, Tutil, just got yeeted. This is amazing. Amalon has ended. Florida Jumbro! What? Florida Jumbro died? 
How did he die? <gasps> what? Did he get killed? Oh my. Did he get killed? By a competitor? Is that what happened? I'm just locked on on the person who killed him. What? How did Jimbro die? They're the same faction. Th this is Amalamalandon. So this is the one. Why did you... I mean, you stole all his stuff. Why did you kill him? What? Didn't he go mad? Maybe. Maybe he went insane and started killing stuff. Can we see that in the world history? No, we can't see anything like that. No idea. But he died. Oh! <gasps> Florida Jimbro died. At least naked, naked Florida Elf is still alive. He's got some swag now. Look at this shit. Damn, a thousand HP. He's becoming a ferocious little boy. Sweden is rapidly losing population. Yeah, they're clashing with some armies here. I mean, they're not really well equipped. They're just like sending over some random people. Here's a small army from the Holy Owo left. A small expedition force. Is the king still alive? Who's this? Yeah, this is Knugen, still just a stick. Memorable Palka. Okay, well, maybe you need some better tech to defend your kingdom, honestly. Is Gandalf still alive? Because if Gandalf is still alive, they do have a chance to defend themselves. Gandalf is pretty powerful. I have no idea where Gandalf is, though. Maybe I have to check this list. But Gandalf is still alive. Gandalf is just vibing here. Oh, wh what? Wait, hold on. Gandalf... All these minerals I gave to Florida, Gandalf just made a really sneaky expedition here and just wiped the whole thing out. Gandalf, you absolute little rascal. Holy shit, Gandalf. What? That is so sneaky. Sweden was just falling apart. And he's just like, you know what? God bless this island with a shit ton of resources. I'm just going to go down and snag that. What an absolute beast. Wow, Gandalf. That is so cool. Look, he just led his little expedition force here of, of newbies. And he just nuked the entire thing. They burnt the whole they burned the whole thing down. Are they leaving now? Are they gonna colonize this or are they gonna leave? Or is Gandalf gonna colonize it all by himself? Oh no, they're leaving. Oh, that's just the frog. Um so are they not going to colonize it? They just wiped it out. This is getting wiped out too. Sweden is going for... <gasps> Florida! Here is Naked Florida Elf. Oh my god. Naked Florida Elf is taking some serious damage, but he's kind of a badass. He's, he is not going to go down without a fight. Look at this. Goddamn Naked Florida Man is just wiping out the Swedish expedition force. Village Dumb Harbor was destroyed. Oh my god, Monkey Island finally got wiped out by the Holy Owo. Click three plushies on their way to me, loving the vids, giggling like a baby. On the last one with the crew, we are building an emotional support village. That is so sweet, Alex. Thank you so much. You're absolutely amazing being this wonderful thing. Okay, they're loading some people into a boat. Okay, how, how is he doing now, the king? Um, he's kind of low health, but he's still very much alive. He has some decent equipment. I mean, some leather, nothing super impressive, but... What, how is the culture doing? What can you do in terms of smithing? Well, not much. None of them have really developed like any interesting materials. Um, not really. Their mineral tech is really shit for some reason. If this is now nobody owns this now. This is just a ghost town. Gandalf just came to burn down the resources of Florida and then left. Oh, what is going down here? What is this? Oh, this is a Florida army. They're fighting Gandalf! Gandalf is defending the Swedish shores. And now he's on fire. <laughs> okay, well, he, he dipped himself in water. He's fine. Yeah, this Florida army is... Just, oh my god, Gandalf is such a badass. Wow. Now he's, like, shooting down boats. <laughs> god damn, maybe you should dip yourself in water, Gandalf. Yeah, there you go. Gandalf is pretty... I didn't even give Gandalf that much 
buff stuff. Like, a lot of the other chosen ones are really buffed out, but he has, like, a lot of good stuff, but not, not insane amounts. Where's Florida? Where's Florida, man? Here's Florida, man. Fl Naked Florida Elf is... He's doing well. He's a bit wounded still, but he's doing okay. They need to take this back, though. They need to re-expand into their colonies. And this one is also open now. How is Sweden doing this well? It's at war with two empires. Okay, now, now they're kind of starting to... Oh god, here, came, here comes the big OO army. The Holy OO just launched their main force. This is going to be a bloodbath. I mean, Gandalf is powerful, but I don't think Gandalf is this powerful. New village Sirka has been founded. Oh, the Holy of O is taking over Monkey Island. That is interesting. It will be interesting to see if, uh, if the humans become the dominant species in this world. You know, just like kind of the story goes in Middle Earth. That's kind of interesting. Oh, wait, what is going on here? Another army from Florida has landed. Gandalf is no more! Gandalf died! He burned to death in a tree! <gasps> I don't think Sweden is gonna stand anymore. Gandalf actually died. Oh my god, he caught fire in the battle with the Florida army and, uh, and succumbed. Rest in peace, Gandalf. You will be missed. He was a good character. His, his assault against this place, like Mineral Island, was absolutely insane. Florida was punching them back and he just snuck around the back, wiped out the entire colony and just left. What a beast. He will be remembered. Oh, wait, hold on. What is going on here? Ah, oh, it was a sw small Swedish force, I think, that landed. But Florida is still fine. Yeah. Sweden is still at war with both of them, but they're kind of holding on. Nobody has really established a foothold. They don't really have any, like, interesting technology. It's going to be... Intriguing to see if they can actually hold anything without Gandalf, because Gandalf was really a key player. So this looks like a Florida army versus the Swedish army. And the Swedish also have, the Swedish Dwarven army also has the advantage that these naturally spawning things, like these super swords and stuff, they seem to be allied with them. So they only attack the enemies, which is like a small defensive advantage. See, they're like patrolling around here, but the dwarves seem to be allied with them. So the fact that the dwarves have this crystal biome is a huge defensive advantage. That's probably part of the reason why they're able to hold this place. Can we get a check on hell? Uh, still hell. Yep. Village Ubrubrubra was destroyed. Okay, well, it's still here, so I guess they just built another village. So Florida is slowly re-expanding to the old colony. But they they need some time to recover. Oh my god, now Sweden is just in complete war. Even Knugen is running around stabbing people with a stick. I think he's gonna die. Oh no. He's been ruling Sweden for 187 years. Ah, can we please make a video of polyamorous memes? I wish it could be more normalized tolerated. Possibly. I think otherwise, ask one topic. He's really into those kind of videos, and he does them really well because he knows way more about the subjects than I do. But it's an interesting topic. I might look into it. Are you winning, son? Mario? I would say yes. I created all the kingdoms, and one is bound to win. So, hell yeah. Oh no, Knugin just ran into an archer army. <gasps> Knugin of Sweden was killed by Epony. Epony, the Kingslayer. I have no idea who Epony is. It's just one in the masses. Here's Epony. Kingslayer. Memorable Palka. You stole the king's weapon and his jewelry? I mean, it's kind of shit jewelry anyway, but like, damn. Age 23, already a Kingslayer. I'm gonna pop you on the favorite. You king, you killed the king. That's pretty impressive. Oh my god, it's a random lightning spike? <gasps> king Zuma of Sweden? They just crowned a new king? They just died instantly? No. Yeah, it's like, it's what I thought. Without without Gandalf, Sweden is kind of falling. They still have the farmlands down here, though, that are kind of peaceful and untouched. Look at this. You know, nothing is going on. The world is fine, and you zoom out and everything is blowing up. Okay, I hope Florida manages to actually recapture this place. 
Mineral Island. Otherwise, they will struggle hard against the Holy OO. I'm really proud, though, that uh, that Naked Florida Elf actually managed to kill 20 people. He, like, took care of the whole expeditionary force by himself. You know what? I'll give you a little bit of a boost. Here you go, Florida. You will get a small bridge over to this island as well. Go forth. Get your shit together before Sweden dies, because I think you are up next. <laughs> Was that a firework? King Kingdom Florida made peace with Sweden. <gasps> that is so sweet. I mean, Sweden is gonna die really bad, but yeah, look at this. Oh, like the crystal boys are kind of helping Sweden out quite a bit. Look at that. I mean, it's not gonna be enough, but that's pretty good. Oh no, this this is a three-year-old. No, <laughs> no, that's so sad. Sweden still has a wait. Holy oh no, this is all holy oh whoa. Sweden still has 39 population. This is Florida army, but they're allied with Sweden now. This is also OO army. Where are the rest of this? Are there only children left? No, they're only kids four years old, five years old. No, there are only small children left in Sweden. I don't think they have anything more to do. I think they're done for. Oh. <gasps> Adam and Steve? Oh yeah, we haven't checked in with Adam and Steve in a long time. So here is Steve. He's just vibing. He's 192 years old. 64 children. Uh, where is, uh, where's Adam? Where's Adam? Adam is over here, vibing in a house. 192 year old, 62 children. They, neither of them have really gone to war. They have just kind of been ruling this massive kingdom in peace. That's the only thing they've been doing. I was hoping for some spicy drama, but they have been actually a really good power couple. And th this part of the world is just complete chaos. I don't think Sweden is going to survive for much longer. Here comes the Owoian army. <sighs> I don't think the five-year-old is going to hold this. Ah. Power of gay. <laughs> Okay, it looks like Florida is going back home. I It's interesting that nobody has tried to colonize these two. I mean, they're very small, but they have a lot of resources. They're like literal gold mines. Florida is slowly creeping their way back here. Oh my god! Sweden got hit by an other asteroid? <laughs> Sweden. Fam. Oh, that's so sad. You check. All right, you should be up here. Did, did everything else take damage? Wait, where's Ooh at? Is this Ooh? Here is Ooh, our favorite Ooh. Ooh. Ooh is amazing. Ah. Such a good boy. Here's just a bunch of wolves, I think. Yeah. Woof. Woof. Waff. <laughs> and waff. Great. King of Sweden was killed. It seems that they just try to crown new kings. Oh, Attil. Here's a new king. He is 14 years old. He has a wooden uh, club or whatever that's supposed to be. He's strong and attractive. Man, what a good king. It's kind of badass. Look at that. His kingdom over 10 people. Everything is burning down. I think you should probably hop in a boat there, boy. Um, yeah, he's dead. <laughs> Sweden has lost like six kings because they keep just crowning the next five-year-old as soon as the king dies. Oh, king died, crown is yours. <laughs> he dies too, and then they just keep doing it. Oh, they still have four people though. I wonder if they're in a boat. They're probably sitting in, in a boat somewhere. Because they still have... Oh, no. The village is destroyed. I think both of these ships are Swedish. Yeah, Sweden. Sweden, okay. So they still have a couple of ships left. So literally a Viking ship. That's pretty cool. Um, how are they doing? Uh, three people left. I think Sweden is done for. They're going to go out the same way Ohio did. Chodron was founded. A new village on Monkey Island. That's very cool. I think Sweden is done for. Unless they go up to one of the tiny islands and manages to, like, I don't know, boom with 
How many people fit here? Five? I, I think they're done for. Is this ship actually, like, attacking things on the island? Why is it just vibing here? Oh, no, it's fishing. Ah, oh, it's a fishing ship. Okay. I think the Owoian army are going home. I'm surprised nobody's colonizing this. The whole the whole land is empty. Old Ohio and Old Sweden are both completely, completely empty. Ohio is coming back. Uh, Ohio is dead. <laughs> they got literally wiped out to the last the last orcish little child. There was nothing left. God damn. I wonder when the Holy Owo is actually going to start rebelling. Because the thing, they keep their villages so happy. Look at this. Everything is, the least happy one is this one. But it's still not like super unhappy, you know. I don't know when they start rebelling, but it's probably not that minus 15. They're just so happy. It's insane. Adam and Steve are doing an amazing job at just holding this kingdom together. I want to see if they actually start trying to populate hell. Because you can make it. There is an approach here. It's not inaccessible. It's just really difficult. Just wait for the Ohio final boss. How's Naked Florida Elf doing? Okay, Naked Florida Elf. I just ran inside a building, but let's check him here. Naked Florida Elf. Here's how he's doing. He's healed up a little bit, so he's fine. He's got some equipment, same as before. He's doing fine. Almost 200 years old. He's doing pretty well for himself. Which other favorites do we still have alive? We have U. And we have Adam and Steve. Oh, the Kingslayer died! <laughs> the one who killed the Swedish king is already dead. I didn't even catch that. Um, okay, Adam... Steve is actually a bit damaged. What happened to Steve? Steve, how are you doing? <gasps> when did he take damage? Maybe Sweden came over with like a small attack force or something. That's very possible. Adam is doing well. They're both just vibing. Or maybe you get hit by lightning or something. I mean, that could also happen. I want to see if the Holy OO starts colonizing and if the colonies start rebelling. Because let's see, which is the... This is the least happy one, right? Is this one of the island colonies? View village. Where's this at? Yeah, exactly. It's one of the island colonies. This is the least happy colony in the Holy OO Empire. Well, I'm expecting that to kind of be the case. You know, when when the Holy OO start expanding to this big thing, then I expect this to become a separate kingdom. New village Eron has been founded. Ooh, Florida elves are actually expanding. Hell yeah. That is good to see. Go Florida. Kingdom Sweden was destroyed. <gasps> their last boat with like their two remaining four-year-olds was sunk. Sweden is officially ripped. Their champion, Gandalf, uh, died heroically. He was actually pretty badass. I want to see someone capture hell. Me too. I want to see someone go for this. <laughs> you know, if nothing else, this it's not quite the time yet, but one thing I will do if they don't go for hell after this is colonized is probably just create a land bridge from hell to the Holy Oo Empire and just have them duke it out. More resources in old Ohio? That's a good idea, actually. I'll just pop some silver down, pop a little adamantite down, a little bit of mithril, a bit of gold up here and down there, some random ore, maybe here, here, and here. I'm just going to put some food down as well. There we go. Excellent. That should be a motivator to colonize this. Florida's doing well down here. How is actually Florida doing in terms of technology? Uh, still very poorly. They do have armor production. <gasps> Casey, thank you so much for the 50. That is way too generous. Oh my god. <laughs> I love that emote. I do hope you enjoy the stream. Thank you so very much. That is amazing. Wow, I'll spend that on a pineapple pizza, I promise. Mm, yes, indeed. Unleash the hell if they take too long. Oh, definitely. Definitely, that is the plan. It has had a very interesting development, though. I do like this. I'm a little bit disappointed with that they're not really... Developing technology very well. Knowledge gain, yeah. Culture conversion. Because usually they develop smithing and stuff. I'm not sure why they haven't done that. That's what gives them better weapons and stuff and armor and cool shit. 
Because right now they're stuck with like stone and leather, which is like tier one. And then it goes all the way up to adamantite. It's like five tiers or something. <clears throat> release the demons. We shall release the demons soon. Yeah, I'm not sure if anyone is going to take over hell. Like, this amount of resources is enough to fund your army for, like, eternity, but uh, to take this, uh, yeah, it's going to be challenging, to say the least. Are they actually just going to let... I mean, if Florida takes over all this, and all the resources that come with it, they could actually pose a decent threat to the Holy OO. Have you given them basic stone? I did, but we can give them some more. I'll just pop this place full of stone and here, and I'll pop the Holy Owo full of stone over here. Yeah, but maybe that's it. Maybe they had too little stone, so they couldn't develop like the mid-tier. I'll give them some ore deposit as well, just basic ore. Like that. Some down here in Florida. Maybe a bit on the colony. Why not? Some here. They should have enough, but we'll see. Maybe that's the case. Maybe they need like a certain amount. Because let's see, what uh, what do they actually have? This village, for example, the main village. Uh, they have four stone. I'm not sure how much they need to develop stuff. They have a shitload of gold, though. Jesus Christ. That is amazing. But now they should be able to uh, harvest some of that. <clears throat> yeah, they're already mining it. That goes fast. I opened board box for the first time in years, made like 15 kingdoms, and the moment they got some stuff, they went straight to mass genocide. <laughs> yeah, sounds like humans, all right. I downloaded a custom map of like the United States with all 50 states, and oh my god, the moment they have like 20 population, they just go at it. And they have so, they just duke it out. I'm gonna create Lucifer. Okay, let's pick a powerful one. Um, someone who's old. Who's an old demon, 106 years old. I think they're probably about the same age, right? 107. I'm just gonna pick one with a powerful sword. Because that's a pretty good, that's a pretty good start. Yeah, that's pretty basic. Meh. I want one with a legendary sword. Uh, rare sword. Nah. Nah. Ooh, red voice, that's badass. Hell yeah, this is gonna be Lucifer. The leader of hell. Favorite that one. I am also going to add you a bunch of stuff. Lucifer is obviously attractive, very agile and fast, strong. Obviously a veteran and strong-minded. Um, greedy for sure. Gold tooth, that sounds very much like it. Uh, very sparkly and savage. Obviously a dragon slayer. And what else? Deceitful. <laughs> oh yes, indeed. Um, what else do we need here? What else? Kingslayer and Lucky. Just like everything. Burned. Definitely skin burned. Yeah. Weightlessness. Not Mage Slayer. Bloodlust. This is Lucifer. Right here. Look at that boy. Leader of Hell. Let's see when we unleash this upon the world. It's gonna be interesting. I wanna see though if Florida actually expands. How is their culture doing now? Are they actually expanding in terms of tech? Maybe. They have their colony up here, though, which is doing quite well. They're mining some resources. They're starting to slowly expand to the mainland. That's really nice. How is this colony doing? They're actually doing really well. Look at this. The Lemon Kingdom colony. I'm a bit disappointed that nobody has actually grabbed this, though. This is like a free resources. Oh, well. The Holy OO Empire. I am impressed they have held together. I don't understand why they are so happy. You know, I've never... I've played this a bunch of times now. I don't think I've ever seen a kingdom get this big with all the colonies being so happy. I just came here and Sweden died? Yeah, Sweden died. How is Adam and Steve? Hmm? How's Adam and Steve doing? They're just vibing here. Here's Steve. Still a bit hurt. That is odd. Do you have regeneration? You do. Hmm, that's weird. I wonder if you get sick or something. And here's Adam. Adam is doing incredibly well. 211 years old. <laughs> how's, how's, how's Naked Florida Elf doing? You have actually recovered your health. 211 years old as well. God damn. 
Who's the person who took over here, though? Who's the mayor of this town? Is that you? Yeah, it is. You're the mayor. Anne, 56 years old. Nothing impressive about you. Yuck. How many favorites do we even have left alive? Well, we have Lucifer. We have you. <laughs> but these are the only three people left. The champion of Ohio died. Knugen died. Gandalf died. Damn. Renamed to Uwoshifer. All right, fine. Or Uwoshifer. Absolutely amazing. Ah, I love Uwoshifer. I am surprised nobody has taken this faster. This is just like a literal gold mine waiting to be on waiting to be dug up. How are you doing in terms of tech now? Mm, nothing super new has happened. Culture spread, all right. How is that, how are the cultures doing around the world? Yeah, basically two cultures. Everything else got wiped out. It's Emma and uh, Sverurab. All right. Hmm. I mean, Sverurab is definitely more advanced. But these have also been kind of crushed by uh, by warfare, so makes sense. Maybe speed up for a bit. That is a good idea. See if they actually do something. Let's just pop on a five and see what they see if they expand. There is no heaven. <laughs> New village Jovo has been founded. Ah, look, the Holy O Empire is expanding here now. I'm still surprised the Holy O Empire hasn't captured this. But I guess we'll see if they actually get to it. So this is going to be interesting. I'm expecting Florida and Holy O to clash here at the old Swedish-Ohio border. Because I think Florida is going to keep expanding here. And, I mean, OO, OO is expanding this part. So let's see where they actually end up clashing. Oh my god, it's a tornado! No, oh well, it's kind of in the middle of nowhere. It's not doing much. Ew, is too powerful. Another tornado. Why are so many tornadoes all of a sudden? Eh, it's kind of ravaging the shoreline up here. Oh yeah, it's smacking uh, this poor little village. But not too much happens. Damage a couple of ships. A new village was found. Ah, oh, they landed here as well. That's a very good idea. They're going to expand a bit faster. Yeah, I think... Oh my god! Why is it only old Sweden that gets hit by asteroids? There have been three asteroids in this game, and all of them are hit within this area. One right here, one right here, and one here. What? That is bonkers. Okay, this is actually pretty big now. Oh, wait, I can't drag. There we go. So they are going to end up clashing somewhere here, because they're both expanding really fast. Holy Owo is almost at a thousand people. How are your village... How is everything so happy? How is there no civil war? This is the least happy one, and it's like, basically happy. Where Where is this anyway? Oh, it's this place. Yeah, they're not going to rebel by themselves. Of course they won't. God damn, how are they so... How are they at like almost a thousand pop and no civil war? How is that possible? Just waiting for the tea to spill? Yeah, we're just sitting. Oh my god! Another meteor, but it hit like the ocean right here. So it didn't do much. Are they gonna go to war here? They are moving an army into this land. Uh -huh. The new village was destroyed. But oh my god! Yeah, this just smacked right into the Holy Oh. Well, first meteor that doesn't strike all Sweden, pretty much. I am impressed the Holy Oh well is so peaceful. I am really impressed. Has declared war of. Oh my god, Holy Oh well got hit by a meteor right as they declared war. Okay, let's speed it down to twice the speed so we can keep up with the warfare. 
So they're all, oh, they have so many armies. Florida, no. Florida, please. Imagine zombies. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh. Oh, don't tempt me, Chad. Do not tempt me. Oh, yes. Florida gonna burn. Yeah, how is the technology doing here? Florida has, like, decent army training one. Okay, so they have some decent military stuff, but they're still missing the tech upgrades. How are these ones doing? They're also missing it. It's so strange. Like, the smithing is just completely borked for some reason. So odd. Yeah, you view village. Yeah, they should have enough resources to do things. Gems, they have everything. Zombie island? <gasps> oh, yeah, I'm gonna do a zombie island for sure. This is really duking it out. I think Florida is gonna lose this colony. They do not have the army to stop this. Oh, no. Oh, it's all just children. They're like four years old. This is just a colony of babies. They're all like two years old. Here's one 13 year old. That's like the, that's like the village elder. Oh, no. Oh, dear God. This is a slaughter. It's just babies. All of it is babies. Holy shit. No. Well, goodbye, elven baby colony. So much for that wholesomeness. Jesus Christ. They just got absolutely slaughtered. Village ear almost destroyed. They did not stand a chance. I don't even think they had a single soldier in there. Holy shit. Wait, here is an army from Florida. This is where the Florida army was at. It was just vibing here in the crystal region. And now they're moving up for a counterattack on the OO territory. Yeah, they're picking off some stragglers here from the army. I mean, they're doing a pretty decent job. Even though they only have sticks. Yeah, look at that. They're actually, they're doing some good jury love warfare right here. I mean, but they're not gonna be able to capture this. They have three, three army sections and the Holy OO has like six. The, this is not gonna work out. I mean, they're putting up a good fight, but but I think this is gonna be... A necromancer has spawned. Where did that... Hold on. Hold on. Where's the necromancer? <laughs> he just... Oh, God, yeah, necromancer died. Rip. He just spawned in the middle of an army. Well, good luck. GG. They're actually... Oh, my God. The Florida army is actually doing work. Oh, no. This is also a colony of babies. They're all like just four years... One year old? No. No, this is so bad. They're just killing baby colonies back and forth. No. <laughs> this is so sad. <laughs> Naked Florida elf died? <gasps> he did. No. He died right here. He died defending his kingdom. He was killed by Eri, who stole all his shit. This spear was crafted for the old naked Florida king 159 years ago. Naked Florida elf is no more. He was slain by Eri, the, the, the human. <laughs> Rip. That is so sad. That is so sad. That was the favorite of the entire stream. Well, they fought very bravely, but I think Florida is done for. Let's put this back to normal speed. Oh, look at this. This army is really thick. Florida has a, some people left here, but do they even have an army? I don't think they do. Oh, they have an army up here, actually. They are still duke. They are still just... Oh, my God. Instead of having their army at home... Defending their last home kingdom. They 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 are still just bloodthirsting in the baby colony. <laughs> They're just, you know what? Frick this. We're gonna get payback. They are so petty, man. You should spawn a dragon to pay respect to the wood elf to the nude elf. Yeah, we should. But I think the dragon is gonna fly into the kingdom and die right away, sadly. But we will do it. I'll spawn a dragon in hell, maybe. Is it gonna attack the demons? We'll see. Uh, where's the dragon? There it is. 
Yeah, the towers are trying to shoot it, but it's not really doing much. Is the dragon just gonna... Is this gonna attack the Holy OO, isn't it? Yep, I think so. Oh, god, yeah. How is their army doing? They're actually decapturing a bunch of stuff here. I mean, it's just babies here. This is like a six-year-old just running around. <laughs> Yay, I can do it for my kingdom! Whoop! Dead. Great. GG, Timmy. Look at the- they actually decaptured the entirety of old Ohio. Just these, like, random guerrilla fighting leftover armies from- from Florida. I mean, at the same time, the- the home kingdom of Florida is dying. So... Oh wait, they actually, they're actually holding this. But the, this is a oh, well army, so I think this is just linked to to whatever is left up here by the army. I think it's the army of this village, so to say. They are still going at it, though. They are really on a rampage to avenge their king. Look at this. Here's a big boy. God damn. Yeah, these ones bit off a bit more than they can shoot. They ran into a little defense force here. Oh my god, you have so much swag. Oh, you have copper. That's pretty cool. Damn. This is pretty much a badass, but... I sla sadly think you're gonna die, because there's just too much. I mean, even if even if I help them out, they're just gonna die anyway. Because there isn't much left of this kingdom, period. But goddamn, they're holding on. Did they die? I think they died. That's sad. Where's the rest of the army? Is it? Yeah, there's there's a small, small army. Oh, is this it? Is this the last, last army? I think so. The last force of Florida. Yeah, they're not gonna survive. They're already really wounded. Ouch. <laughs> that was a really good last effort, though. They completely wiped out old Ohio. Oh my god, what is going on here? Did they go back with the last of their forces and just get completely destroyed by this gargantuan army? Oh, look, this is this is the person who killed the necromancer. <laughs> or or the one who picked up the staff at least, 18 years old with a freaking necromancer staff. Nice. This is starting to feel like Game of Thrones. All of our main characters have basically been wiped out. We have, we, st we still have, uh, Florida, eight people. It's just people in a boat, I think. They don't have any land left. I think it's this boat right here. That's like the last thing they have. Passenger zero. Oh, maybe it's not. Or, or maybe it's just that. Oh, here is one. Passenger zero. Or maybe it's just boats that are left. Like it's only counting boats and the drivers, not any pass. Oh my, God, what happened here? <gasps> oh, the dragon is going, going ham here in hell. Well, it sort of went ham. Now it's going home. To wherever it's home. I wonder how the dragon is going to do against this. Do they have any... Oh yeah, they're starting to get a little bit of, little bit of, uh, little bit of weapons. How is the culture doing? Ooh, they have a lot of housing. House tier, housing, damn. Oh yeah, material bronze, copper. Okay, so now they're actually starting to develop better weapons. I'm not sure why the dragon insists to fight in hell. That's pretty silly. They're just destroying all the resources. <laughs> but they're just shooting fire at each other, and they're both pretty fire resistant, so nothing is gonna happen. I'm just gonna do this. <laughs> dragon! Uh, oh my god, I picked up a bunch of stuff by accident. That's that's a lot of people. Um, <laughs> I mean, you can have fun down here, I guess. Go! Oh my god, who's the- Oh no, I picked up a Lucifer! Oh shit! I didn't mean to do that! Uh, okay, he died fast. Uh, Lucifer. Um... Uh... <laughs> um... Mm. Ooh. Uh, okay, let's- let's be- let's be delicate about this. Lucifer. Um, okay, there we go. A couple of people, that's fine. That's fine, that's a worthy sacrifice. Whee! Uh, back to hell you go. And... Splendid. That's fine. A couple of couple of people came along with. That's okay. Oh wait, the dragon is still alive. I thought it was dead. Look at all those arrows going. I mean, it has a lot of health. I wonder if they're actually gonna. Oh my god! It blew up the entire farm. Is it actually going to die? Yeah, it's gonna die, eventually. 
But they don't have super good uh, weapons. They have like wooden bows. Holy shit! <laughs> How many kills does this dragon have? 95! Oh my god! Well, uh... I, ho I hope uh, Adam and Steve stays out of trouble. They're still alive at least. Luwoshifer is alive, barely. Ew is still alive. Adam and Steve are alive. They're t almost 300 years old. Florida is wiped out. Is Florida still alive, like, with a boat? Florida still has seven people alive. Somewhere. This dragon is really wreaking havoc. Now it's just kids here as well. They can't shoot. What is it? This 16 year old unarmed person just running around. Oh dear. I wonder if this dragon is going to go to sleep somewhere. That is one awesome dragon. Oh, here's another army. Oh, there's only one person in- Oh my god, everyone died! There's only one person in the army that has a bow. Oh wait, no, here comes the whole bow army. Holy shit! They just landed. Kingdom of Florida was just destroyed. Yeah, I guess the last ship sunk. The entire bow army came home, but then they ran away. Oh my god. I don't know what they're doing. They're just running away. They're letting the south fall. 1,400 people, and not a single rebellion. Now the dragon is almost dead. Yeah, they have a couple of bowmen left here. They could potentially kill it. A wild mage has come to bring chaos into this world. Ah, we'll see. Maybe we get killed by the wolves. But I'll put you on favorites, just so we can keep an eye on you. Ah, he actually survived. First one to set foot on this island. <laughs> nice. How's the dragon doing? Oh, the dragon died! <gasps> that is impressive. Who actually killed it? Pretty hard to figure out who killed it. Maybe one with a bow? Ooh, they got bronze armor now. Dragon Slayer! Oh, this is the Dragon Slayer. This is like... That, that was like Generation 3. Of our main people. I am gonna give you some chosen stuff. You're a badass. You kill the freaking dragon. You're attractive and agile and fast. You're not evil. You're fireproof. You have fire blood as a reward for being a dragon slayer. Uh, you're kind of deceitful, I would say. Um, you're definitely lucky if you manage to kill a dragon. You're also wise. You're strong-minded and strong. What else do you have? Regeneration for sure. That's not too bad. You're also kind of greedy. You're a bit full of yourself because you managed to kill a dragon after all. Um, I think that's pretty good. I think that's pretty good skills. Veteran, for sure. There we go. You good boy? Oh, yes, indeed. Very good boy. Make sure to regenerate health so you don't die. You're very tiny, but you're a badass. Holy Oo stability. The power of the kings. Pew pew, one topic at the time is in the chat. One topic. Do you like my kingdom? This is the holy OO. They just wiped out Ohio, Sweden, and Florida. Though that was an orc kingdom, an elf kingdom, and a dwarf kingdom. They killed the king, which was the naked Florida elf. It was very sad. But at least uh, Adam and Steve are still alive. Uh, this is Steve. Damn, Steve has some freaking swag. Look at this. Silver boots. Steve is kind of hurt, though. I wonder if he took a swipe from the dragon. Hmm. Well, yeah, they're both a bit damaged. I wonder if they actually did take a, take a swipe from the dragon. <laughs> Memorable friend. <laughs> it's a 200-year-old stick. <laughs> Great choice of weapon there. Great choice of weapon. Uh, how are you doing? Oh, you actually have silver now. I'm going to speed this up and see if they actually try to conquer hell by themselves. Because now... The only things that can go wrong for Adam and Steve at this point in their lives. Your favorite Aush. Oh, that must have been the. Oh my god, it's a meteor. Was that the. That must have been the evil mage, right? Yeah. Yeah, that was the. It was killed by this guy. Ooh, that's pretty badass. Devil Strike. 
Mage Slayer. Nothing super interesting apart from that. I'll leave you to it. We do have some favorite. We have the Dragon Slayer, which is a pretty badass. We have Adam and we have Liu Hifer in Hell. I want to see if either they can no longer... Oh my god, an undead... Oh, it's a Necromancer. I don't think he's gonna last, to be honest. He had some skeletons there, but Dragon Slayer is here as well. Burple was killed, switching to Dragon Slayer. Did you actually kill the mage? Hold on, wait, 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 wait. You did! Oh my, that is so badass! Dragon Slayer just killed a mage as well. <laughs> there we go. That's a pretty honest title. Should we name him something else, maybe? What should we name him? He just killed a mage and a dragon. Without me even putting him up to it. He just, he just did it. That is insane. Todd? <laughs> Aeon? I like Aeon. Look, no, like, like that. There we go. Aeon the, 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 the Slayer. That's pretty badass. This is something I would name a character in D&D when I was 12. Excellent. Oh, beautiful. We have a couple of favorites. Eon the Slayer. What a badass. 35 years old. He only has two kills. And that is a dragon and a necromancer. God damn, talk about saving your shots for like the big targets. Jesus Christ. Is he a mayor or something? I don't think so. No, he isn't. The Holy Owo almost has 2,000 people. And they have almost colonized the entire map by now. I don't know how their kingdom is so stable. Any other kingdom would have rebelled multiple times by now. Call the Slayer one topic, the Slayer! <laughs> he has two kills. Yeah, it's the dragon and the necromancer. He really is a main character. My god, what a beast. Did we actually make him immortal? I just want to make sure. I think we did, right? Yeah, we did. Perfect, so it doesn't die of old age. How's the culture doing? Um, they can craft silver. That's pretty cool. So, I think after silver, it's like steel, and then it's mithril, and then it's adamantium. So, I think they're coming along quite nicely on their tech route. But I want to see if they can develop enough so they can take over hell. This is like the final frontier on this map. This is really nasty. And here is Lewo Shefar. Do you actually regenerate? You're supposed to, at least. New village DB was founded. They have taken over the old crystal meth islands of old Florida, where the naked elven men used to roam. <sighs> that is so sad. They don't have a reason to conquer hell, there's nothing there. I mean, there is. Oh my god, wait! Wait, there was something fighting. What was that? Hold on, what? I mean, there's a shit ton of, uh, of valuable minerals. I think they would go for that. Something was fighting right there. I didn't have time to see what it was, but... That could have been an expedition force. The Holy Oa has almost captured the entire world. How are they doing in terms of villagers? How is everything so happy? They're insane! This is like the most stable kingdom I've ever created in this game. That is insane. Usually they're just rebelling back and forth. It's just completely unhinged. This is incredible. The ground is shaking. Oh, they had a big earthquake. They're gonna have to rebuild a lot of this. I think they'll be fine though, they have a lot of resources here. They just need to repopulate it. And they're also taking over this. And they are basically- oh yeah, look at this, this is the old El oh my god, what was that? I have no idea, maybe it was one of the meteor or something. Yeah, look at this, this is the old burned villages of Dwarven Sweden, this is the elves. <laughs> The old elven buildings of Florida. Just the ruins of old civilizations. The islands have been left alone, yeah. Yeah, like these two islands. I'm a bit surprised. 
<laughs> Ooh is still alive. 211 year old bug. <laughs> Great. <laughs> Maybe these islands are too tiny. Maybe they don't see it as anything valuable just because they're too small. Do you have the ability to directly give equipment to an individual? Um, maybe with the debug menu, but I don't think I have that by, by default. Steve, 305 years old. Now we're talking, look at this shit. Mithril armor. Hell yeah. Now we're getting somewhere. Now they're getting beefed up. Uh, is this... Yeah, that's Adam as well. He also has a lot of swag now. Damn. They have basically colonized all of it. Click, you missed my super chat. Oh, no. Oh. Now I didn't miss it, at least. Mwah. Name the ice one island and the other one grassland. <laughs> Flip flop it. Ew, it's the Lord of Flies. I mean, it makes sense because it's a very tiny island. I'm not sure if they're actually going to capture hell. Oh, they, they are trying to! They just dropped off a ship with people. I mean, they got completely wiped out instantly, but... But I did see that time. Oh, an evil mage has spawned. Oh, he died? Instantly. He just landed on this island that is basically just an army. Oh, evil staff. Mithril helmet. Look at this badass. 69 years old. Nice. Peak of your life. How is the rest of our favorites doing? I want to see how Aeon the Slayer is doing. Meh, nothing new has happened. Still two kills. A meteor just landed in the middle of old Sweden again? Oh no. Why is it always here? <laughs> is this place magnetic or something? <laughs> oh, that's amazing. I think... Oh my god, they actually try to land again. Look. They're actually trying to colonize it, but but they're landing unarmed children. This is not gonna work. Look, oh, they're actually killing this demon though. He's like stun locked in a corner. Wow. They're actually kind of doing it. But yeah, it <laughs> I mean Hey, one child. <laughs> Let's slow this down to, like, uh, two times speed. Yeah, look at this. It's only 20-year-old. Uh, chonky obivivivivi. None of them have weapons. They're just rushing into hell without weapons. Oh, did they actually kill something? How? Okay, are these even damaged? A little bit, yeah. If they keep sending people, eventually they'll kill something, and then they'll get a good sword. So... <laughs> The islands are too tiny to build anything on? Yeah, I think so too. Let's expand them a little bit. Let's just do it like this. Give them a little bit of space. There we go. And then we'll just make a little bridge between them. They looked very cute and pretty, but, you know, maybe they'll actually colonize it now. Ooh, need some friends. Are they still dropping people off? That is sad. At least bring a fire extinguisher. Yeah, it is hell. I mean, you could bring a bucket of water and you could like, kill those demons easy. Yeah, let's see if they actually colonize this. Maybe it needs a bit more space. We'll just do it like, like this. It's a bit of a clunky island. It looked very cute with the two small islands, but if they're not being used, then there's no real point to it. Very nice. Holy oh whoa. Almost 2,500. I mean, they are mining up the last resources here. I suppose they're just cleaning up the old buildings from the old fallen <laughs> Florida elven civilization. Oh, that is so sad. I miss I miss naked Florida elf, man. Look, they're unloading more people. Oh my, that's a lot of people. I mean, they're all gonna die because they're completely unarmed, but... I'm not sure what the plan is here. I mean, they are taking some damage, but it's not enough. Oh, here we go. This is the final frontier. Can they actually capture hell? Everything else is captured. Well, apart from this, I guess, but... Oh, it's ooh. Look at that. It's ooh. But they're probably going to capture this as well pretty soon, I'm guessing. 
Oh yeah, look, they have they have a couple of colonizers right there, but they died. Oh, and the polar bears are fighting the wolves. Um, yeah. Yeah, look at that. They're dropping off colonizers here too. They are making the kind of silly mistake I've noticed that they don't send an army to colonize places. They just keep dropping off people until they break through, which is a bit silly, especially in places like this. <laughs> a necromancer spawned. Damn, he has a lot of skellies. Where is this at? Oh, it's on the main OO continent. This is not gonna go well. Yeah, so much, so much for that necromancer. <laughs> Yeah, I come here with my five skeletons. Yeah, and it just ran completely stomped by an army of like two thousand. God damn! How how big is the army actually? <laughs> yeah, no wonder he got stomped. A single necromancer. Yeesh. As a final battle, let's do this. I'm gonna create a bridge between hell and the mainland because they just keep sending colonizers and they're not doing too well let's do this hell on earth baby we connect it to the nearest shore good luck <laughs> i think hail Island is actually being named a proving ground for the empire's young or a place to drop their criminals yes yeah, something like that here we go the final battle everyone's saying oh whoa are you are you rooting for lo for chat or are you rooting for uh, adam and steve Remember, Adam and Steve also has Aeon the Slayer on their side. Is Luo Shifer still alive, or is Luo Shifer? Um, oh, there is Luo Shifer. Couldn't see the star in all the yellow. Luo Shifer is doing pretty well. What a champ! <laughs> oh, here's a little colonizer willing to challenge. Oh my God! Look at this. It's an entire family. They're looking for a new home in Hell. They just have to bash their way through Orov, the 230-year-old demon. Did someone actually get his sword? They did! Well, they're burning to death, so that, was, well, that wasn't very smart, but... Oh, there's so many people! Holy crap. Did they actually colonize this? I mean, they're slowly working on it. The polar bears are just killing everyone. <laughs> All right. I'll leave them to it. They'll get there eventually. They killed one demon. Ah, they're sending in 13-year-old Mesh. <laughs> Great. Good job. You have an army of a thousand people. Look at this. This is their armies. They're just standing here. And they're sending in their, ch <laughs> their fucking children. <laughs> Why? <laughs> this is the first line of defense. Look, this is 11-year-old Gusu, <laughs> completely unarmed. Ah, 30-year-old Ukli. Great, now the tide is gonna turn. Yeah, maybe not so much. Oh, now the army is coming. Look, <gasps> holy shit. Oh my god. Oh, this is a small demon. Look how short it is. It's like a clunky one. Oh my god. They might actually be able to take hell. Is the Holy Owo Empire actually going to take hell? The ground is shaking. That was just a random earthquake in the ocean. Nothing to be worried about. Look at this army. I guess they're just waiting for this to be colonized before they move in. So just slowly capturing their territory into hell. Okay, let's see. Let's upgrade the speed to three. So they move in a little bit faster. No, no, Lu Lucifer! Oh, Lu Lucifer is getting completely porcupine. Okay, let's change it to speed two. I want, I want to see the battle of Lu Lucifer. Can he even get? He, uh, he just exploded. That, that was Lucifer. That was Lucifer. I am noticing Ot. Ot, how are you doing? Do you smell nice today? I hope you smell nice today, Ot. Oh, yes, indeed. Lucifer just ran in. He was trying to be an inspiration for the rest of the little demons, but it didn't work out so well. So, so there are... This is a 21-year-old unarmed, and here is a 35-year-old unarmed. And here's the army just waiting. <laughs> ah, they're sending an 18-year-old Leitwe. Great. Uh, yeah, they died.
this empire. Oh yeah, they took o they took it over. Look. Oh, something got nuked. Oh yeah, <laughs> meteor just hit in the middle. This empire is amazingly stable. Are you actually gonna take over? Oh, there's a demon. Are you actually gonna stab it? Someone grab the demon sword. Look at this champ. Damn. Now they have the final smithing and stuff. Am I hearing dragons spawn for the death of the king of hell? <laughs> well, the dragons aren't allied with the demons. That's the problem. They just kill each other. So it, it kind of just creates chaos. It doesn't do anything. Oh, oh. The demons are incredibly tanky. Jesus Christ. Yeah, I mean, they might be able to take hell eventually, but... Let's do this. Let's create a little bit more land here around it. Let's do it like this. The walls of hell are crumbling to create space for a giant battlefield of glory. Move in, my small ones. Move in. I mean, it's sort of colonizing, right? Maybe we should replace the ground by something more fertile. Let's do, like, forest. Why not? Wee Forest! There we go. Do you want to colonize that? You little spoiled shits? Hmm? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Uh, let's see. Maybe some grass seeds. Hmm? Will, will this have you enjoy it? You little poos? I mean, there isn't really much resources here. Maybe some jungle. That, that usually creates trees and stuff. There is a great jungle in front of hell. They're not really amazing at moving in, are they? We need to see U. I think U is just vibing with his new friends. Yeah, U is right here. 260 year old bug. That is amazing. I mean, they are slowly but surely creeping in their colony right here. Oh! They- That is a cocky village. Oh, the village died. <laughs> This village lasted for like three seconds. One child ran in, made a village, and died instantly. Ah, they're kind of duking it out. They do have some pretty badass people now. A meteor just struck hell? It even killed one of the spires. That is a turn of events. <laughs> they're just going in with the civilians. Look at this, they're just swarming from the whole kingdom. How is the kingdom doing in terms of happiness? Oh, they have a few colonies now that aren't too happy, so I think that we might see some rebellions. But I want to see if they can actually kill this, because this is really difficult. They probably could if they actually amassed their armies, but right now it's just a really awkward small village here with civilians. Here is a badass, though, that managed to grab a demon sword. Uh, somewhere in this mess. Yeah, look at that. They're like slowly equipping themselves with demon swords by killing the demons. Okay, now they all burned up, so I guess about back to square one. <laughs> oh, wait. Meh. Fifty is a breaking point for rebellions. That is good to know. So it's very close. So they have a few... Fifty-seven. Okay, so I'm guessing they're not big enough. There must be two numbers that decide if they actually rebel or not. Oh, this burned down completely. You know what I'm gonna do, chat? You know what I'm gonna do really sneakily? Because hell is not really doing what I hoped it would do. So I'm just gonna close this off. Hell has been closed from the world again. Screw everyone. I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna do this. I have a very devious plan in mind. I'm gonna connect everything with small stripes of landmass. Let's see if you can figure out where I'm going with this. So you can travel between every piece of land, including these tiny ones. We can just connect these ones. We can connect these ones. Um, now I think everything should be roughly connected, right? How about down in this corner? In the olden days of the Florida Elf, they did place a curse on the land in the far past that anyone who took over your kingdom should suffer. 
This curse is a virus that spreads through living things. And if something dies, well, <laughs> it becomes one with the army of the dead. Let's see how long it takes until the cursed kingdoms of man succumb to the apocalypse. <clears throat> they have a really chunky army though, but I think a couple of them got infected, so they will probably start falling. Yep, there's a bunch of infected people, their, their army is slowly crumbling, look at this. This is gonna spread throughout the world like wildfire. Almost 3,000 population. I also need to make sure that our heroes are actually immune. Hold on. Are you immune? Traits. You can't get sick. There we go. You have immunity. Same same with the other ones. Adam and Steve. Do you have immunity? I think... No, I didn't give you immunity. I'm going to do the same with you. So you can actually duke it out fairly. Boop. There we go. Excellent. They are infected. They are fighting it back bravely, but they will slowly but surely get overwhelmed. <laughs> Click Click is playing Plague Inc. now? I am the ancient curse of Plague Incorporated. <laughs> oh yes, indeed. Suffer. Suffer, humans. They're actually doing a really good job at fighting it back. That's a badass bow right there. A mithril bow that looks so cool. They're basically all infected now. This island is gonna fall. Oh yes, the sounds. The sounds. Oh no, they're running around. No, they're gonna spread it. Oh no, it's spreading. Oh no, it's gonna get into the children colony. Oh god. Oh no, this is bad. It's still kind of contained to just this island and the, and the paths here in between, but... Oh no, now the army has fallen. Uh-oh. Now we can slow this down a little bit, like, times two. Look at this. It's starting to take over the children! Oh, not the children! Not the little poopy ones. Oh god, this is so bad. This champ right here is doing incredibly well. This archer is amazing. You can be our new Legolas. Wait, hold on. You are naturally immune? Holy, this is amazing. This person is actually naturally immune. That's why they haven't died. That is so cool. I am going to give you some cool stuff. You're now immortal. <laughs> you're also very attractive and strong and a veteran. And you're weightless. It's absolutely amazing. I'm also going to give you a bunch of immunities. And you have a healing aura and you regenerate. That's pretty good, I think. You're also very fast, because you're Legolas, and you have a bloodlust, like Legolas. <laughs> Legolas, you can do this. Natural immunity, that is so cool. Yeah, this zombie picked up- Oh my god! This must have been a soldier that died. Look at all this swag on the zombie. That is amazing. Okay, oh god, this- Oh my god, they have already completely swarmed this town. Suvisil is bravely holding the line, but I don't know about that, fam. I don't know about that. You should spawn Crabzilla? Oh yeah, I know, I know. That's gonna be the finale after the zombie apocalypse, then Crabzilla is gonna come into play. How is... Who, is this Legolas? Why did Legolas pick up a sword? <laughs> Legolas, what are you doing? This... okay, well... <laughs> This, this random zombie killed Legolas because he picked up a sword and just ran in and <sighs> Ooh needs immunity? Oh yes, yes, you're absolutely right. Ooh? Immunity. Splendid. Oh, this is a badass. Mithril Axe. Damn, what, a, what an absolute beast this is. 1,400 HP. Okay, you can actually have some immunity. I want to see how you do in a fair fight. That is really badass. <clears throat> what an absolute champ. I mean, they're, they're not going to be able to, to 
hold back the whole zombie apocalypse, but like, damn. Oh, here comes the army! They actually landed a whole force. Are they actually striking back the whole apocalypse? I think too many got infected. They did a really good job wiping that out, but I think too many are- Oh my- it comes the rest of the army! <gasps> but they're already infected, like all of them are shaking. They're just gonna die. Look, this entire army is just standing here for contamination. This entire village is a ghost town. Look at it. It's completely abandoned. Yeah, this village is falling too. There's gonna be a zombie boss? Oh my god, that'll be amazing. How are our favorites doing? Nobody has died yet. They haven't really gotten out of... They're already here! Oh no! They're already starting to infect the entirety <clears throat> of old, uh, old elven kingdom of <laughs> uh, Florida. I don't think they're gonna hold that. But the kingdom is still holding 2,500 pop, but this part has already died. Yeah, there are a couple of zombies here. But this is definitely gonna fall next. Look, the entire army is rushing in now to try to contain this. But, I mean, they're, they're just kind of infecting and expanding really fast. I'd laugh in he if hell gets infected somehow. Oh, that'd be so funny. Can it actually get infected? Hold on. <laughs> I guess it can, right? Yeah, this demon is a zombie. Or it has the virus, at least. Yep. Here is a... <laughs> here's a... Here's a demon zombie. <laughs> okay, well, they, they killed it off. Oh my god! Where did this come from? They just landed a massive transport ship here. What? How is the zombie apocalypse doing, though? Did they actually stop it? Did they actually stop the zombie? They did. I mean, they're, they're still going on here, but... Okay, no, they're not stopping this. They managed to stop the, the small part here that was left over. But not this here. Here it's spreading uncontrolled. How's Hell doing? Hell seems to be doing quite fine, actually. They did land with a massive colony ship, though. So they did try to make a colony here in the corner. <gasps> no! <laughs> Our favorite Aeon got struck by a meteor! No! He killed the dragon. Killed the mage, survived for like 200 years just to get struck by an asteroid? No way. Oh my god, that is so sad. That is so sad. Well, I'm gonna do I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna save this right here. Check this out, chat. And I'm gonna do one finale. Well, two finales. I'm gonna do one finale on this part of the world, and I'm gonna do one finale on this part. Check this out, chat. I have an idea. I have a creature in mind for this. It's a very beautiful, cute creature, right? Um, I don't remember where it is, though. Maybe it's here. Here it is. Uh, this is my beautiful creature, okay? Do you like crabs, chat? Do you like crabs? This is my crab. I call him Steve. <laughs> yes, yes, death. Oh my god, I am a benevolent king. Oh, look at that little boat. He died. The thoughts of existing in a bok descended the citizens of Tonson into madness. 
Hold on, what? <gasps> we have a village that's gone mad. Oh, it's the village with you. Oh wait, maybe maybe not that much happened. Okay, well, stage two. Time for just a little bit of madness. Oh yes. Excellent. <laughs> succumb. Succumb, my subjects. Oh yes. Succumb to madness. And after the madness comes the actual zombie apocalypse, which is this one. This is a bit more effective. Oh yes. This army right here? Zombies. This whole village? That's uh, they're already zombified. This whole army right here? Uh what about this village right here? Looks peaceful. Um that's another army. Bye. What about this one? Excellent. Ah. Oh yes. Oh yes. Ah, the armies are tearing themselves apart. They're all infected. Village was destroyed. Oh yeah, now old Florida has actually finally fallen. This is actually kind of surviving somehow. Yeah, look look at the population number. They still have an army here guarding their king Steve, who's now 400 years old. Oh, this is pretty bad as equipment. God damn. What a swag lord. They're just struggling a bit with the zombie apocalypse, though. This is gonna be tricky, because the army is gonna devour itself. They have really good shit, though, so they can actually fight it back, maybe. Well, then maybe not. Now it's starting to escalate. <laughs> and down here as well. They're trying to hold the zombies back, but the Empire of the Holy Owo is slowly succumbing to the old Florida curse. Oh yes, indeed. No more. No more for the kingdom of Owo. After all the sins they have committed. I mean, honestly, it was a pretty good kingdom. Not gonna lie. It's just battling everywhere. This, These ones actually survived the madness. That's pretty impressive. I wonder if any part of this map is actually gonna survive the zombie apocalypse. Like, naturally. I mean, obviously hell might. Because it's disconnected. But apart from that. Oh yeah, now now it's escalating. Wait, where are heroes at? Where are heroes? Steve is down here. Okay, oh my god, this is getting intense. <gasps> Every wait, no! What happened? No! You got killed! You got killed! <gasps> when did you die? Oh, maybe the mage killed you. That would make sense. Oh no! <gasps> Wait, who killed Oo? Oh no, Oo has died. It didn't even specify who killed him. That is so sad. Probably killed by some random stuff. Oh no. Oh, the best bug ever. Rip Oo. Oh. Look, they're actually holding this back pretty well. They all have bows, which is really smart. But it's starting to like slowly escalate a bit. Steve is just vibing down here. Where's Adam? Oh no, where's... Okay, there he is, there he is. Adam is still alive. Adam, 406 years old. They have some really swaggy equipment. Adam and Steve are holding... This is where they started. Adam and Steve started here. In this valley. This is where the whole kingdom of Owo started. Some... Uh, how long ago? 390 years ago. They started here. And now they're slowly succumbing. To the onslaught of the zombie apocalypse. Oh yes, indeed. Oh, they're coming from this side too. They only have kids left in this village. Do they have any soldiers left to help them? <clears throat> they do have some armies left here. Maybe they're coming back to help now. But this is uh, this is not looking promising. And this part is completely cut off due to the zombies. It's just wastelands of dead people. Oh no, the horror. How are they doing? Here is here, here are the last stand. Adam is fighting bravely. Where's Steve at? <gasps> Did Steve die? Okay, no, he's not dead. They're both alive. Somehow. They're both holding on really bravely. They have incredibly good equipment and they're both immune. So they're not gonna die easily. Oh. 
Oh no, so many people are getting infected. This is bad. Here comes the rest of the army though. Maybe if they can clean it up fast enough, the kingdom might survive. This part is completely messed up though. I mean, they're, they're holding it back best they can. They at least have the right idea with bows and stuff, but it's simply too much. They're just getting overwhelmed. <gasps> Your favorite Steve! No! Steve died? <gasps> where's where's Adam? Adam, he died. Did you know that he's dead? No, Adam, the sparkly, shiny bear boy, is the only one left alive of the original population. Everyone else has succumbed to this world. He's not really fighting, though. He's just watching his corn grow. <laughs> <laughs> the Empire is screwed. Yep, pretty much. Oh my god, it's amazing. Oh, it's so sad. No. They are holding pretty well, though, not gonna lie. Oh, the entire South has fallen. This kingdom seems pretty isolated. They do have some zombies here, but if this person can hold them off, then they might actually survive. No, don't, 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 don't do melee. Don't, mmm, don't, okay, well, it kind of worked. Oh, no, 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 mm, 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 that's a bad idea. That's a really bad idea. Okay, mmm, great. Yeah, I mean, they're going to expand into this zombie horde eventually, so I don't think they're going to survive either. The main capital is actually holding quite well. Adam is just holding on here. He's got an upgraded bow now. This is pretty swag. Yeah, now the population is starting to dwindle. Oh, no. Well, in a last attempt, I suppose it is time. Wait, there's actually people alive? <laughs> Wait, what? Oh my god, look, they survived! <laughs> look at this! Oh, oh my god, two years old? Nice! Not bad, Owo! Not bad! Finale. There we go. It's a little bit laggy. <laughs> I think that was the finale we all wished for deep down inside. <laughs> Thank you all so much for watching the stream. We had an absolute blast. And I do hope we can play more of this game in the future. It's really fun. And I do hope you have an amazing rest of your day. Take care, everyone. And have an amazing evening. Mwah! <laughs>